Hello, oh, that's the wrong screen. There we go, that looks better. Hello everybody, thanks for coming. Got a little uh, World Cup going on here. It's been a little while since we've ran the game on here, but it should be a fun time. Um, let's see, okay. So our first script is Codependence Anonymous version 2.0, and I was asked to go over some of the changes between uh, the script and the last one. They typed up a little, uh, a little paragraph of the differences. So uh, the biggest changes between this script from the previous version, they swapped out the poisoner for the Saranovis. Thought there was too much poison, and the Saranovis adds some different, more interesting reasons not to trust people. Uh, a very high droids in environment is tough for a balloonist, so they added a snake charmer, taking out the balloonist. Uh, the pacifist was a little too hard to track down, so they swapped that out for a tea lady. And they also added in a godfather, uh, which complements the gossip pretty well. So those are your major changes going on. Um, let's see. Dependence. Alrighty. So we're going to do the setup. Let's see. So it has to be randomly shuffled, and then we can make a few changes, but we'll try to keep that... Uh, as little as possible. So I'm just gonna let it randomly shuffle a couple times. Alright, what are we looking at? So we have a Vigor game with a Witch and a DA. So really good targets for the Vigor Mortis, so I think we're gonna definitely keep that in. <clears throat> I'm actually pretty fine with the setup. Um, we do have to make one Townsfolk evil, but that'll help balance the fact that we're also getting rid of an outsider. So, I feel like with the Sailor and the Sweetheart, that might be a better option than just doing the Barber. Because we do have, although these are starting info roles and these are kind of ongoing. Hmm. Yeah, especially because we have the Sailor already, I think maybe the Barber would be the one to keep, just to add some variety on there. Um, let's see. So we have to add a townsfolk now as well. Uh, oh, I mean, well, we could do a we could do a huntsman and force a damsel in there as well, but uh, let's throw in a librarian. Well, maybe not, because we only have the one outsider. I guess a big question is, who are we going to make evil? I mean, I'm immediately looking at an evil snake charmer, and that would be very uh, amusing, but maybe not the best way to go. Um, evil gossip could definitely cause a lot of chaos. An evil amnesiac would have been really cool, but that's quite all right. Hmm. Evil Cannibal could be really interesting too. Yeah, you know what? I actually like Evil Cannibal because then they'll have uh, a lot of reasons to want to get people killed. So I think we'll make the Cannibal evil. And let's throw in, let's throw in that gossip. And assign randomly. Alright, we have a very evil north. And then one more evil all the way down here. So our clockmaker is going to get a one. Um, our, we got our bounty hunter. Uh, who is our uh, bounty hunter ping? See, this is problematic now though, because if the clockmaker gets a one and we say that, you know, Patters or Loki is evil, then that's going to immediately narrow down the demon. So I think we almost have to give Cat as the evil ping as well. That's what I was thinking, because then it won't, it won't immediately throw the, the, you know, the demon under the bus. And we don't want that right off the bat. And other than Bluffs, I think that's all we gotta worry about. So Bluffs will have... Let's do Monk. Let's do Puzzle Master. And let's do Huntsman. Um, cool, I think we are ready. That was pretty easy. 
All right, let's go see our players. Oops. Hello. 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 Everybody ready to go? Hell yeah. All righty. Yeah, you bring and it on. Appreciate everybody who came from various channels to make this happen. Um, let's get everybody into your cottages. I don't know the big fancy bot that they had that moves everybody all at once. There we go. Okay. Let's send out characters. Alrighty. And we'll go to our minions first. <clears throat> Hello, Loki. Hey. How's it going? Yes. Going all right. A little, little under the weather, but well, nothing that a little clock tower can't fix. Yeah, and a, a nice, a nice uh, laid-back role like the devil's advocate. <laughs> um, a little bit of responsibility. So your fellow minion is Patters, Ooh. and to just keep you all as one nice happy family, your demon is George. <laughs> no way. Okay. Uh, we'll come back for the others. Thank you. Hello, Patters TTV. Hello. Thanks for coming. Ooh, uh, yes, yeah, you are. Me. You are the witch. Uh, your fellow minion is Loki. And okay. To, and to keep you all as a big happy family, your demon is George. Perfect. All together. Alrighty, we will come back for the rest. Thank you. Thanks. Hello, George. Hello. Oh dear. So you are the Vigor Mortis, and you are in good company, uh, literally, because your minions are Loki and Patters. Oh, fantastic. And uh, your bluffs are Monk, Puzzle Master, <clears throat> and Huntsman. All very entertaining. Thank you. Alrighty, thank you. All right, let's see. Uh, we're gonna go start with Debbie. Hello, Debbie. Hello. Thanks for coming. Uh, you are the sailor. Please select a player for me. Uh, it's gotta be Patters, I think. It's gotta be Patters. All right, appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks. Okay, well, so she selected Patters. We could delay the witch and kind of, you know, let Debbie have her invulnerability at least once. Uh, there's no leech on the script, is there? There is. So maybe keeping Debbie sober at least once is not a bad idea. I mean, obviously, she, you know, some other characters, that would be a little different, but... Hmm. I think, I think, we, I think we do... Drunk patterns at least this one time. One, because it'll hide the witch, but also if Debbie tests it immediately and finds out that she was uh, drunk, then she'll almost certainly know that she hit an evil player. So at least this first one, we're going to let that go. Let's go visit Mary. Hello. Hey. How's it going? It's, it's all right. I was yeah. worried I was going to be evil, but... Well, now I'm pseudo that, evil. <laughs> that, 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 that's to be determined. <laughs> I'm going to choose. Uh, let's see who's who's here. I'll just choose. Um, let me choose Emma. Emma, it is. Thank you. Hmm. Oh, I mean. You always kind of do and don't hope for that day one snake charmer. Um, all right, let's go to Loki, and we'll 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 let Cat know she's evil later. That's not anything that she urgently needs to know right now. So, hello, please select the player. Um, I am gonna go with. Um, I'm gonna go with myself. Yourself, it is. Thank you. Hello.
Hello again. Hello. Please select a player. Uh, I will select Dak, please. Dak it is. Thank you. Alright, we just won't do anything with that. Because um, you can choose the same player, so we'll just not put the token down and confuse ourselves later. Oh, we have a grandmother. That's right. Uh, who is our grandmother going to see? Perhaps... Perhaps they can know Dak and have a reason to protect them. Can't do Debbie. Can't be Cat. Uh, we don't want to verify Nick either. Mary could swap. So it's got to be Emma, Dak, or Hazel, or Tanfana. Uh, I think we go with Dak. Let them know that this is your outsider. And also, that's going to give them information that it's not going to be a Vigor minus one and a Godfather minus one. Uh, we can't we can't make it Cat because it has to be a good player and Cat is evil. Uh, I think I think that works. Um, let's go. Where are you? Hello there. Hello. Thanks for coming. Thanks for playing. Uh, you Hello. are the grandmother. And oh, I'm here to let you know that your grandchild is Dak, and they are the barber. Cool. And, yep. yep, that's all I got. Thanks. All right, let's see. Five, we are going now to Tanfana. Where are you? Oh, there we go. Hello. Hi. How's it going? Well. Good. Uh, you are the clockmaker, and I am here to give you a one. Oh, that's spicy. And that's all I got for you. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. So now we go to Emma. Hello. Hello. Long time. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. I think we tried to uh, we tried to remedy that like a month ago, and that didn't work out. So. Uh, yeah, it didn't happen. Glad glad to have you. Yeah, nice. I'm glad to have you storytelling again. It's been it's been too long. We have to remedy that sometime. For sure. Um, you are the dreamer. <laughs> I am. Please select a player for me. I would like to dream about this wonderful person called Kieran. Kieran. You see Kieran as the grandmother or the godfather. Okay. Oh, imagine if I'm their grandchild. That would be funny. Or the godfather. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was a perfect pick, because our grandmother knows an outsider. So either way, Kieran knows an outsider, and either of those roles would give that information. So that was that was a great pick, Emma. <laughs> uh, let's go to Nick. Hello. hello, Nick. Hello, hello. Thanks for coming on very short notice. Thanks for having me. And you are the bounty hunter. Yes, I am. So I am here to tell you that you know for a fact that Cat is evil. Ah. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, cat. Hello. That's right. I'm visiting you. Oh. I'm here to let you know that you are evil. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Cool. Thank you. All right. Um... We are good to go. We can uh, bring everybody back. Got my janky bot here. Let's. Almost everybody. Can't all have the fancy bot. There we go. 
Good morning, town. You have discovered that your storyteller has died brutally and everybody is really sad about it. Please avenge my death. Okay. Oh, I'm really sad about that. <laughs> I'm feeling moved toward vengeance. Hey, hey. How's life? Works. Oh, life is pretty good. Except, you know, work, work, work's not great, but, you know, we, we play clock towers. Oh, good. Hell yeah, boy. So, I think you should go first. Okay, I am the sailor. Did you pick me? I didn't. It was a toss-up between you and Patrick. I went with Patrick. That's probably a good thing. So, I'm the bounty hunter and I picked Cat. Or, I didn't pick, I received. Okay. So, hopefully you're not lying and I won't get you after we kill Cat, but... Hopefully you're not lying, and you did in fact not pick somebody with your ability. That's true. Uh, I'm not. I'm, I'm I'm the bounty hunter. Yeah. Oh, oh, you chose, I chose me. Yeah, I chose you. Okay, okay. that's good though, because then at least that can kind of back me up later down the line. <laughs> oh, so you didn't believe me when I was like, "Are you my minion? I'm no. your demon." <laughs> <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> I, did. I picked you. <laughs> oh, could you imagine you ain't no demon? <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're the drunk. Oh no, there's no drunk. <laughs> okay, well, cool. Yeah. Um, cool. I'll probably just feed my information to you every day then, and I won't tell anybody else. Well, what if I turn evil? Oh wait, never mind. I'm not gonna tell you anything. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, but if you turn evil, then I just kill you and I win. <laughs> yeah. Because well, I know who you are. Well, we'll see. There's there's like a lot of drunk things and things, so I'm just not sure. And I could be okay. lying. But Let's I'm just not. Speak. You could be lying. I also could be lying. <laughs> yeah, but I'm also not, so don't kill me. <laughs> okay. We're taking okay, a risk. But maybe, um. Okay, well, I can tell you now that I dreamed Kieran last night. Dreamed Kieran. And the, the evil role that, role that I saw Kieran as wasn't a demon. So if you want, like, a safe sneak charmer pick, maybe Kieran. Okay, cool. Yeah. Just, to, just to clear them of the demon, maybe. Yeah. I don't know, if you don't want to turn. Or you can just turn and then we give you. I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not going to tell anybody else I'm the snake charmer, so. Uh, you can. Uh, that's pretty cool. Yep. So, uh, what do you want to uh, ex exchange? Uh, I want to know if you woke up last night. I did wake up last night. You did? Okay, yes. I did not. You, where are you on this thing? Okay. Alrighty, you know Wakey. I know Wakey, so you know Wakey. I I know Wakey. So I'll tell you that makes me um, the gossip, the monk, or the sweetheart. Gossip, monk. Wait, sweetheart doesn't uh, wake up, does it? No, the sweetheart does not wake up. Uh, oh, and the yep, yeah, they all don't wake up. I was thinking, I was thinking it was the other way around. Well, the monk, the monk will wake up later, but. Yeah, that's that's what I was that's what I was thinking. I am either the sailor, the dreamer, or the clockmaker. Bounty hunter or snake charmer? Oh wow, what a spicy too that is. Um, well, the librarian cannibal's very spicy because I've heard of that before. So. Ooh, a specifically librarian cannibal, you say? Yes, specifically. Oh, that's absolutely buck wild. You love to see it. No. Uh, okay, well, I mean, I wouldn't worry about it for the time being. Okay. Um, all right. All right. Uh, if, if, if a bounty hunter ping were to exist, uh, should I know what it is? Um, if I am the bounty hunter, I'm going to hold on to my ping for right now. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, all right, well, yeah, uh, feel free to let me in if somebody needs dead. I'm happy to oblige. Okay, sounds great. All right, cheers, I'll catch you later. Cheers. Oh. <laughs> if I am lying, it's because I'm a good player. And I'm not coming out with stuff. Yeah, but, I see. Okay, okay. I was looking at all the choices for bluffs, and I'm like, damn, like, you can't, like, bluff as the monk. You yeah. can't bluff as, like, you know, or whatever, the magician, like, People will come for you. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's, I think, going to be a lot of people lying, even if they're good. Yeah. So it's going to be rough. <laughs> yeah. But oh, God. You got this, Mary. 
All right. Do you do you have yeah. any suspicions yet? No, <laughs> it's way too early. Okay. Hopefully someone just messes up and someone catches it and they can tell us about it. All right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Want to hit that? Yeah, let's go back. Let's go back. <laughs> there we go. Uh, do you want to die? Uh, how about a two? Um, sure. Two, three, whatever. Okay. Uh, I will give you Bounty Hunter or Snake Charmer. Okay. Interesting. Uh, are you lying to me? I don't lie to anybody. Okay. Well, I'm the grandmother and I saw you as the barber, so... You saw me as the barber? Yes. What? Karen, you ruined all my fun. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's not... <laughs> <laughs> it's I mean, nice I, to know that I'm confirmed, but yes, that's, you ruined it all my fun. <laughs> I'm not, not going to tell anyone. It's fine. That's good. That's good. Um, yeah, no, I'm telling everybody Bounty Hunter Snake Charmer. I will tell you, I've heard the same two out of two people sitting side by side in my first two chats. Okay. I heard the exact same two, Librarian Cannibal. Oh, interesting. So, uh, yeah, I, I have heard of a bounty hunter, by the way, so... Oh. Yeah, I'll give it. I'll, I got it too. Cool. Uh, I picked Patters first night. You picked Patters first night? Okay, cool. Yeah. So, Not we need sure. to talk... Have you talked to him yet? No, I'm I'm kind of running a screen. Like, seeing where... I'm going to give it a day, because... It's kind of... Well, one, I don't know if it is wrong. Mm -hmm. But it means that I can kind of keep a tally of when and where information might be wrong. So mm -hmm. makes sense. I'm gonna maybe you want me to uh, bluff his uh, sailor a little bit, or try to get some see if Patters is a good drunk candidate or something like that, or are you just content with telling everyone you're sailor? I have not told everyone I'm sailor. I've also been telling people on the bounty hunter and a few other like maybe. <laughs> oh um, yeah, as you should. But yeah, I mean. I will I will tell Pat as if I have time today. <laughs> That's hilarious. I mean I told someone that I was the uh uh that I was the magician and they were like, What? And I was like, Yeah, I'm the magician. No. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. cra cra crazy's my middle name. First. Uh yeah. Uh Dak is Dak is clearly something that wants to be killed, so let's just kill him. <laughs> yeah, I I'm totally out for that, yeah. Um Yes, it's a bit of a shame the positioning of the, the minions. It makes obviously I'm I like doing the vigor kill when I get the chance, but obviously only you can only have one available neighbor. Yeah, so at least we'll know who will be putting on them then. So it's yeah, useful. it's true. Um, um, in any case, uh, if Dak votes, we don't we don't nominate. We won't have to kill him, but yeah, yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, all right, well, kids, as I won't stay too much longer, but uh, yeah, Perfect, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Studios? We might be out of time. We are out of time. Wow, Emma, I didn't think we took up two minutes, but I guess we did. Uh, I'll catch you tomorrow, Hazel. I just, I just love hearing your voice, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice playing a game with you, Hazel, for a change, instead of you just storytelling. I haven't story told in so long now. <laughs> I feel so like yeah. I want to story tell, but I'm so good playing. Alrighty, tell. Fun to play with you. Take a moment to chat, and nominations will open up in a minute. Kira, was the answer to that question yes? Uh, I mean, I'm not going to tell you. If so, it's planned. Uh-huh. Fair enough. <laughs> People have plans in this game? What? Already? <laughs> Never. Right. Always win it. Always just win it. In classic Townsfolk fashion, I'm a live fast, die young uh, character, so... Dick, are you so talking not about the grandmother of really? dying young? You know what? Some grandmothers are pretty young. I'll tell you that. Yeah. Maybe kids young. Um, how do you want gossip, Sandra? Out loud? Uh, out loud, please. Okay. Are there juggles on this script? No? Alright. Uh, uh, can I gossip that there's a fangu in play? Thank you. Hanfana will gossip that the name of the person that has the demon token 
has a number of letters that is a prime number. Oh my goodness. Are <laughs> <laughs> you trying to make us all think? Thank you. Um, Hazel will gossip that Nick was chosen during the night. Thank you. Nick would right. like to gossip that if a clockmaker was in play, they would receive a two. Thank you. Loki right. would like to gossip that the demon has only one syllable in their name. Thank you. Kjul, uh, you would like to gossip that uh, no outsider is sat next to the demon. Thank you. Flash. Emma would like to gossip that the outsiders have been modified. Thank you. Cat would like to gossip that there is an evil townsfolk. Thank you. Uh, Mary... Mary would like to gossip before all the gossips are taken that um that um someone is drunk. Thank you. Uh Pathers will gossip that uh the bounty hunter received correct information. Thank you. Nominations are open. Okay, so who made the worst gossip? Um it might be George. Uh um, nominates Dak. <laughs> Hatters nominates Dak. Oh, buttons. There we go. Prosecution, please. Uh, Dak is in a double claim, is my understanding. Um, or the second claim they gave me is a weird thing to share publicly. So. All right, Dak. Uh, he is correct. Uh, I did give him a very weird two for two. Um. I'm not the best kill for today. I've heard of two different double claims of two exact same two for twos. I'd rather go after one of those. Alrighty, all players alive. If you want to execute deck, you need six. Hmm. Hmm, maybe it needs to be a second. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right, we'll build suspense. All right. Surprise, surprise, I'm not throwing myself down uh, the road today. Oh, drum roll here. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we're going we're gonna to take that down. <laughs> <laughs> Three is not enough. Dak is safe. Hazel will nominate Tanfana. Hazel nominates Tanfana. Prosecution, please. For her glorious gossip that obviously is not something we want to go off. Um, also because she's my neighbor. All right, Tanfana. I resent this accusation for my glorious gossip implicated <laughs> me as possibly being a demon. How dare you kill me before I find out whether or not I'm the demon. <laughs> Alrighty. If you want to execute Tanfana, you need six. Five is not enough. Nobody on the block. Uh, Debbie will nominate Cat. Debbie nominates Cat. Prosecution, please. I've heard there's a bounty hunter paying on Cat, and as we were discussing beforehand, there's not a lot of ways to mess with that information, night one. All right, Cat. Um, I'm not the best skill, but if Tom wants to, I understand. All right, if you want to execute Cat, you need six. We punish people for sleepwalking. <laughs> yeah. There's a strict curfew in this town. You can't be breaking that. Seven is enough. Cat is on the block. Any other nominations? Loki nominates Nick. Loki nominates Nick. Why? Uh, there were a lot of hands up for that. Maybe if it, cause, because of the... Um, the bounty hunter ping, but usually when there's a ton of hands up, it, it usually kind of leans to me that they're more good. Um, and I've heard that Nick might be a good execution today. All right, Nick. Uh, I have since gathered information that Loki, if uh, no. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, there, there are seven on cat. Eight if you want to execute Nick. 
I like the thought though, Loki. I love it. That is the, long run. This is smart play. Hang on, it's a smart play. Okay, I'll put my hand up. Man. <laughs> Four is not enough. Final call for nominations. Cat is executed and dies. The game continues. Everybody go to sleep. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Um, I was also really looking forward to, uh, you know, an evil cannibal, but what are you gonna do? Now the problem is, is that we still have a clockmaker one they don't know that Cat is necessarily the evil townsfolk. So the Clockmaker 1 could throw Kieran under the bus, and if Kieran's backing up Dak, that can make those two look like that could be your whole evil team, potentially. Well, I guess Bounty Hunter would have the one still, but... Uh, but yeah, we do have to give one of our... Uh, I mean, we could give George, but we're obviously not going to do that. We have to give one of our minions. So let's just see how the night plays out, and then we'll decide, Nick, uh, if... They're alive. So first, let's go with Debbie. Hello. Hello. Uh, please select um, a player. I'm gonna go with Karen, please. Karen or Kieran? Kieran. Okay. Yeah, Kieran. Uh, that sounds Thank good. You. Thanks. All right. Uh, we'll go ahead and make Kieran drunk. It doesn't really affect anything yet. We will make Debbie drunk, but. In the world where Elite is still possible, I think her surviving ex uh, execution at least once is not a bad idea, but uh, that's not going to... If she's never nominated, we'll still drunk her eventually. So, um, yeah. Let's see. Uh, number two. Mary. Let's see if we can get something exciting. Hello. Hello. What's up? I will choose Tanfana. Tanfana it is. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, that's a great point, too. I guess if they kill Kieran and Dak doesn't die, then that is some interesting stuff going on there. Well, we'll see what happens. You got to do some things to throw them through some loops, right? Uh, Loki... Hello. Hey. Please select a player that is not yourself. Yeah, yeah. I think I'm going to do a little crazy stuff. I'm going to choose Emma. Emma it is. Thank you. It's interesting. I'm guessing he's going to try to push on Emma and she's not going to die. And uh, We'll see. Patters. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. Uh, we're going to stick it. Oh, depends who George has killed. Let's go with... Go with Debbie on the chance that it isn't... That Dak is still alive. Debbie it is. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. Well. That's, uh... That's going to be another, uh... No death there. Yeah, I think we're, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I mean, we, we'll token integrity and all that. We'll, we'll, we'll start drunken Debbie really soon. Um, for now, let's go to George. There you are. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. Oh, I'm a little torn, because Debbie hard claims to me as the bounty hunter, and I kind of... I kind of believe that she is, or at least the ping is correct, because Cat gossiped there was an evil town spike, which feels like a signal. But I don't really want to kill her when I don't know how she hard claims to. Um, but no, I guess I don't want to risk her getting another ping, so I'll kill Debbie. Debbie, it is. Thank you. It is. Well, I mean, what are you going to do? So that's going to signal that uh, there's something up going with Debbie there. So there's nothing really else that's going to 
prevent. We have Tea Lady, Sailor. I think that's it. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see if we can give them a hand here in the next couple nights. Deck uh, doesn't do anything. Hazel's gossip was not true. She gossiped that uh, Nick was selected on the first night, and he wasn't. Um, and yes, there, uh, there is the monk bluff that could definitely help him out here. Uh, eight, uh, Karen, nothing happened, so we go to Emma. Hello, hello. Hello. Please select a player. I would like to choose Hazel, please. Hazel. You select Hazel and you see witch or gossip. Hmm, okay. Thank you. Thank you. I wanted to do Godfather and gossip, but giving Godfather twice in a row, I think that's going to start sending some unintended signals. So Nick now needs another evil ping, I think. Of the two, I think they would rather have the DA still around, so we're going to show Patters. Ooh, hello. hello. I am here to let you know that you know that Patters is evil. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Thank you. All right, um, let's see, town square. And one more, there's always one more. There we go. Good morning, town. You awake to discover the brutally murdered body of nobody. Ooh. 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 Interesting. Uh, Monk or sailor? Or tea lady? Mm. That's self poison leech as well. Gotta think about there it. There is that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <God. laughs> We're not letting that one go. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, Debbie, wanna chat? Yeah, sure. Hello? Hello. I am assuming that you are the bounty hunter. Yes. Okay. Who's your next ping? Uh, it's you. Okay. I no longer trust you. <laughs> okay, fair. <laughs> but if you want to kill me, that's fine. What? Okay. Um, some people know why. But, yes. What people? It was a group of six people in Town Square. Uh, uh, yeah. I trust that. I trust that you go... You roll out publicly-ish. Uh... When I when you when I die, which I will I get, willingly go for, it'll all make sense. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I mean, get, you are I actually. I guess he's thing, accidentally but, um, the fortune teller. <laughs> I wasn't. No, I just don't really oh, want to give it to sake. you yet. <laughs> oh, okay. We well, presume you're going to nominate them. Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. I just want to see how they play today. Fair before enough. Before it gets out there. Cool. Do you want to tell oh, me what you actually what? are? No, not really. Because if I don't trust okay. you, it's a bad choice. Fair. <laughs> Understandable, frankly. <laughs> all right. Goodbye. Okay, good chat. Fair enough. Um, I'm uh, also... Nope. Okay, go ahead. I, I couldn't tell you what to do like a one-to-one one one at, at yeah. a time. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you, I'm not the huntsman. Ooh. Bounty hunter, not it. Okay. Um, uh, dreamer, not it. Monk. Yeah, all men. Not my thing. <laughs> Actually, that came out the wrong way, didn't it? Actually, all men is very much. Fun. No, I'm gonna shut up now. Not the monk. Debbie might be the monk with that gift she just posted, though. Uh, oh yeah, it's possible. Uh, oh! I'll, give, I'll give you. I'll give you Barbara for my last one. Barbara. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much. Yeah. No worries. Cheers, Hazel. Actually, bounty hunter Patters. Patters did. But I missed. I missed some. I missed some before Tan and like before me because I was like, I just got to get in there. <laughs> um, That's a lot of writing. Yeah, I'm, yeah. A, I'm a pretty quick typer, but yeah. Nice. Yeah, I, I unfortunately never got in, so I'm just trying to solve it from the periphery. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, we'll see. I'll, I might info dump on you just cause. Let me know. Yeah. I feel like you're good. So I feel like Emma's good. I feel like. Okay. I think Tanfana might be good, but I'm not a hundred percent. So we'll see. Yeah. All right. Let's go back. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> Sounds good. The, and the puzzle master target is the bounty hunter. Does that affect setup? Ooh, I, not entirely sure. Since the presence of an uh, hey, NST look at that. has arrived, yeah. Uh, in case you didn't hear the question, it was if a puzzle master drunks a bounty hunter, does that affect setup? Um. Because they both occurred during setup and they could be theoretically resolved in any order, I would say that, uh, yes, a puzzle master who uh, has a bounty hunter, I think I would probably rule that that can make it so there is no actual evil townsfolk. Interesting. Thank you. But that's just me. Uh, so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, that's, that's cool. Uh, so, there you go. That could be a potential scenario for if there is a bounty hunter out there. The, the puzzle master, or the monk. Uh huh. Uh, if you're the monk, who did you protect last night? Uh, if I'm the monk, I protected Debbie last night. Interesting. Um, I will tell you that I am either the librarian or the grandmother. Ah. Okay. Um. Okay. You don't sound like a librarian who's seen me. Well, I mean, would have spoken to you probably by this point, wouldn't I? Probably, yeah. But, you know, it's a base two outside a game. Days get busy. Base two outside a game, so, you yeah, know. Yeah, absolutely. But, uh, let's go ask. Uh, yeah. Okay, sorry, and it's grammar as well. Right, okay. Uh, all right. Uh, in that case, have, my next question is, have you made contact with your relevant person? I have found someone that seems to cooperate my thing, so, yes. I don't okay. appear to be poisoned or drunk. Uh, all right. No, one at least. That's good news. Um, I've heard that there is a Librarian Cannibal 2 going around, um, so it might be worth your while to talk to that person, if you can find them. Well, I don't know where it is, but it's meant to exist. <laughs> no idea, I, first I've heard of it, yeah, so... I gave, I, gave, I gave that out as a 2 to someone, and they were like, that's a hard double claim on both of the 2s. <laughs> so... Uh -huh. I like that you have a theme, but... I automatically I... do things. It's like Decrypto, like, I give everything in theme, and it was like, why are you doing that? And then they made an expansion where you have to give everything in theme, and I was like, yes! <laughs> well, I wonder... So nobody died on on the first night, so... Hmm. I don't know. So maybe I protected somebody. Maybe I didn't. Well, it, wouldn't you not be able to... You don't wake night one. Oh, wait, I would I wake see. night two. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm fine. Yeah. <laughs> hey, let's go or back. it could be someone's a tea lady, you know? Yeah. The grandmother. And so I figured that wasn't a bad yes, shout Yeah, I've for... heard similar things. Uh... Although his reaction when I told him I was the bounty hunter was a bit weird. So I'm a little bit worried that I'm his grandchild and now he doesn't trust his information. When did you tell him? Did you tell him yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, so I think he. I then told. I wanted to tell one person each day what I actually am. So. I think that's not how it works, though. Yeah, <laughs> that's but. That's not how it and, rolls and you're right. right and you're absolutely right because Kieran fucking said that's a double claim. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that makes sense. So Kieran isn't a hundred on these picks, but you know, we're, we're, we're getting there. You don't have to say. I've already, I've already uh, given the number out, so I don't really mind, like. Give it out. It's a two. Two. Yeah. Um. So I think we. I think we need to. This bounty hunter needs to be public. Um. And we we look into that information. Um, yeah. I'd like or, a little more information about that, or like they poisoned evil. or the evil. Mm -hmm. I I also sure. think that I am being double claimed. Uh, I have an idea of where it is, and I think that would be a good kill as well. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, I was just righty. thinking bigger just because I hadn't heard even slightly. Alrighty, town. Okay. Take a moment to chat or do gossips, and then arms will open. Uh, Patrick. Hello. I simultaneously lied to you and did not lie to you. You're welcome. <gasps> uh, okay. 
okay. I think Nick would like to gossip that a mathematician would receive a three. Thank you. York would like to gossip that there is a tea lady. Thank you. Uh, Loki would like to gossip that there is not a bounty hunter in play. Thank you. Aaron would like to gossip that there's a godfather in play. Thank you. So I would like to gossip that Debbie did not wake up on the first night. Thank you. Hanfana would like to gossip that the demon type's name could not be made in a game of Scrabble in a single turn. <laughs> that was science, huh? Thank you. Oh, that would require me to actually play Scrabble to know. Uh, Padders would like to gossip that either Loki, Emma, Nick, or Kieran are the tea lady. Thank you. Padders, I told you not to give that away. God damn it. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Emma would like to gossip that Cat was indeed evil. Thank you. Oh. Nominations are open. Mm. Not all at once. Mm. Uh, George nominates Kieran. George has nominated Kieran. Why? Um, if my deduction, based on things I've heard, is that we have a, a cannibal in play. And I don't know whether I trust Kieran socially, but in either scenario, probably good cannibal food. Okay, Kieran? How, how dare you suggest that you feed me to someone? Um, especially after Pat has just said I could be a tea lady, George. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, Kim, if you want, go for it. <laughs> That's a great way to test the cannibal. <laughs> Alrighty, if you want to execute Kieran, you need six. Six is enough. Kieran is on the block. Are there any other nominations? Uh, Debbie will nominate Patrick. Debbie nominates Patters. Uh, the bounty hunter would and really like yep, to go. go ahead. The bounty hunter would really like oh. to go two for two. Okay, Patters. Um, I'm happy to die. Alrighty, there's six on Kieran. Seven wants to keep Patters. Wait, people want this over good cannibal food. Not me. Oh, I'm terrible cannibal food. That's a good point. <laughs> I, I've heard I'm actually quite tough. Probably not great cannibal food. Five is not <laughs> enough. Kira's still on the block. Final call. A little bit, little bit overdone. <laughs> hey, making note that Emma might be evil with Pat. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Kieran is executed yeah. and dies. No, he a damsel. Don't kill me. Game continues. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, so uh, at this point, Patters has to realize either that Debbie is not the bounty hunter because they're the sailor or something like that, or the tea lady thing could be a reality, but uh, I'm hoping that he's going to realize that, you know, maybe she's just a sailor. Pretty much never buy bounty hunter claim. But we actually don't get another bounty hunter claim this time, so, or a uh, ping, so that's good. Okay. <clears throat> Um, yeah, we're going to start punishing Debbie a little bit more here, because, uh, it's necessary. Where are we at? Oh, well, we're going to start with Debbie. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. I'm going to go with Patrick, I think. All right, bad as it is. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we're definitely uh, it, we're definitely not gonna drunk him for a second time. That, that would be too punishing, I think. All right, let's see if Mary can make this exciting. Hello. Hello. Who's it gonna be? God, I don't know. 
patters. Patters it is. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. It's getting closer. Uh, Loki. <clears throat> Hello. Hey, I think this one's pretty easy. I'm going to go, I think I'm going to go patters. Patters it is. Thank you. Good shout. Uh, this is game one. I supposedly have players for game two, but I guess if you're in the server, you can uh, stick around and see what happens. Patters. Hello. Hello. Please select a player for me. I'm glad to know that there is a um, tea lady on one side of Debbie. Um, I don't know if the demon knows that. Um, I will choose Debbie again. Debbie, it is. Thank you. Thank you. You're almost. You're almost there. Uh, George. Hello, George. Hello. Hello. Hello, uh, please select a player. Yeah, minor internet up there, I think everything's fine now. Uh, this is very, very bad. I'm pretty sure the bounty hunter is standing next to the tea lady. Um, so I don't especially want to kill Hazel to make it look like the bounty hunter is confirmed, but I might. Uh, maybe I'll save it until after they get Patters killed. Um, in the meantime, I'm going to kill. <sighs> Uh, Nick, please. Nick it is. Thank you. That's great. Okay. Um, I mean, he wouldn't get a new name this time. Uh, but, you know, that, that was already strong info. And then if he comes out as a bounty hunter, they're not going to know what the hell's going on with Debbie. So... Okay, that was that was good. That was a really good pick. Uh, number six is Dak. Nothing happens. Hazel uh, was another false gossip. Hazel's gossip this time was that Debbie did not wake on night one. Debbie, of course, did. Um, go to Emma. Hello. Hola. All right. Uh, who are you dreaming of tonight? Am I allowed to dream you, Andrew? Uh, mechanically, no. No, there's a hint of something else there. Okay, I'll hang on to that hope. Uh, okay, then, in the game, I would like to dream about... Dak, please, my neighbor. Dak, your neighbor. Mm. And you see I... that Dak is either the devil's advocate or the barber. Oh... Possible outsider. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Junk token from Kieran. Ah, yes, thank you. Um, and Nick wouldn't get another name anyway, but he's dead. So, all right, easy night. Me. <laughs> It's always, it's always... Song wasn't over yet. <laughs> All right, one sec. I don't... There we go. Everybody's here. Good morning, town. You awake to find the remains of Nick. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting. Hey, uh, Mary, can I talk to you? Absolutely. Uh, Debbie. Uh, Patters, can we chat? Yep. Yeah. Uh, we have going? On crops since the first day. No, I picked you first day. What minion are you? I'm the devil's advocate. Okay, who's protected? You. Okay, perfect. Because it sounds like you are the the next bounty hunter pick. So. Yeah, uh, uh, I don't really mind. I'm I'm claiming damsel, so if, I will probably just vote for myself. Except you're claiming damsel. Okay. Yeah. Um, is George the leech? George is the figure mortis. George is Vigor Mortis. Oh. Um, Dak has claimed Clockmaker 2. Uh, I am also yeah. claiming Clockmaker 2. Um, what are you, by the way? 
Uh, I am the witch. You're the witch? Okay. I was thinking about um, claiming that I was, like, maybe, like, uh, marking you kind of as evil, and we try to execute you, we, and then uh, maybe l- make it look like you have a Serenovus. Um, or or maybe. were you trying to hint at me that I should be the, um, or that I should bluff as tea lady? No, I think there's, I think there is a tea lady, um, cause I cursed Debbie last night and, uh, when she nominated, nobody died. So either okay. Hazel or Kieran are the tea lady. Dak must be the librarian because he claimed a clockmaker too. So mm-hmm. probably- yeah, he claimed clockmaker librarian to me with a yeah. barber. Yeah. So there's a barber around somewhere. Probably okay. Mary, maybe Emma, one of those two. Yeah. Okay, what is George going as? George, I don't know. If I'm honest with you. Uh, okay. Maybe, um, maybe Huntsman, but... Understand. Okay, so Nick claims Sailor to me. I don't know how true that is. Cat uh, claimed Cannibal, um, so we're good with that. And then I have Debbie as the bounty hunter. Okay. Cat claimed Cannibal. So Cat? Our... So, who claimed Cannibal? Yeah, Cat claimed yeah, yeah, Cannibal. Okay. So there are evil Cannibal. Useful information. Oh, very cool. So they are evil. So we, we Well, we, I assume so, because Debbie has correct information as a bounty hunter, so... That is true, yep. All right, so I'm trying to push on you, Tanfana, or Hazel, uh, since you're protected. Uh, that's fair, that's fair. All right, I'll head back up. Okay. Too wide, too wide. Uh, yeah, sure. I was the cannibal. Oh, what? Yeah, that's why I didn't want to die. Oh, but, uh, that sucks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Karen was really good cannibal food. But you were already yeah. dead. I was already dead. It's okay. Okay, but that's good, because then if people are like, oh, I'm good cannibal food, at least we can... Or at least I won't vote on it anymore, knowing that you're the cannibal. Yeah. Or you're just I'm hearing there's another you're claim just... out there, though. Or I'm just evil. There's another claim? Hmm. I, that's what I'm hearing from other people, but I haven't heard of I haven't it. heard of one, but maybe, yeah. I haven't spoke to a lot of people. Yeah. I see the problem. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I won't say anything. <laughs> All right. Are you the grandmother? Yes. Um. Yes. Hence me voting to get myself killed yesterday. Um. On the off chance as a cannibal, but hey. Uh. Mm. What are you then? I don't want to reveal it yet, but I will probably tomorrow. Oh, okay. Well, I, if it makes you feel better, I won't tell anyone if you tell me now. <laughs> Well, I'm actually debating on whether or not I should just reveal today, because I'm getting nervous. <laughs> I'm the snake charmer, <laughs> ah. and I don't want to be evil, because I'm already stressed just as not even evil yet. <laughs> uh, if you panic, you can always pick yourself. Um, that's true, that's true. Yeah, I might just... Maybe I'll do that tonight. I'll just pick my... Well, no, because I want to, like, clear people out of not being... Like, so it's not... The demon is not Emma, it's not Tenfana, and then it's not Patters. Uh... It's not Emma, Tenfana, or Patters. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. Who's... Are you willing to say who your your good player is? Uh, Who they are? But not what they are? I have... I'll I'll, I'll say if it becomes relevant, I think. (laughs) Because I'll, yeah. I'll choose them if they're good. I mean, I um, I know, I know Dax claiming outsider, so you could always check them. But I have, you know, I've heard that too. Just cut off the, uh, cut off like a fangu possibility. Mm-hmm. But, eh, uh-huh. it's up to you. Enjoy your ability. <laughs> Yeah, alright. <laughs> okay, uh, sorry guys for the ads. Um, I don't usually have that many viewers, like, regularly, so I don't really know that when they're running. I think they're turned off for now. Um, nothing has been severely missed this day, though, but thank you for letting me know. If for some reason they still keep going, please let me know. Um, okay. I think I can get away with waiting a couple more days if I'm the master. Uh, all right, cheers, Stefana. I'll catch you Thank later. Thank you. 
Hey, look at that. Everybody's already here. All right. Let's just, uh, let's move on. Uh, take a minute to chat, gossips, whatever, and then noms. I will gossip that the outside account is exactly two. Oh. Thank you. Emma I would will... like to gossip that there is a leech in play. Thank you. Loki would like to do the exact same gossip. There is a leech in play. Thank you. And Fana will gossip that if a leech is in play, the leech host is from Emma to Tan Fana, clockwise inclusive. Thank you. What? Uh, you would like to gossip that there is no leech. Oh, sorry, was that uh, George? George, go uh, ahead. Gossip, gossip, there is no leech in play. Right. Thank you. All right, Hazel. Um, Hazel will gossip that Hazel is the leech host. Thank you. Value. Uh, can I get a private rules question? Sure. Hey, legit question. Um, for a clockmaker, um, does it go off of the leech or the leech host? Uh, a clockmaker would register off of the leech itself because they are considered the demon. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Gossip. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll still take gossips, but nominations are open. Emma would like to nominate Hazel. Emma has nominated Hazel. Why? Um, I've spoke to a dreamer, me and the dreamer, one for one on the first day, and they have seen Hazel as an evil role, so I would like to get this out of the way. Okay, Hazel. Uh, a dreamer will always see every player as an evil role. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, nope. I do have any response to that other than do as you will tell. Alright, if you want to execute Hazel, you need five. Five is enough. Hazel's on the block. Any other nominations? Loki nominates Patters. Loki nominates Patters. Why? Um, I think if uh, just giving this as another option, I think Patters could be a good kill too if we don't want to kill Hazel. Okay, Patters. I do not think I am a good kill. Alrighty, uh, there's five on Hazel. Six. We'll put Patters on the block. Why has that changed since yesterday, Paz? Yeah, no kidding. Um, there are roles in this game that may indicate whether or not things are a good idea one time and a bad idea at another. Yeah, yeah, Devil's Advocate is particularly one of them. <laughs> well, you had your chance. You had your chance. I don't know what to tell you. Hazel still has a block. I mean, I did. I would have tied it. Like, great. See, Paz is evil. Uh, Hazel no, is no. going to counter nominate Emma. Hazel is nominating Emma. Anything to add? Let's have a chat will, Nick. I will add the fact that it was Patters like, yeah, kill me. And then Emma was like, why are we killing Patters over cannibal fodder? And then Patters put his hand down. And that's why I was like, hey, those two are evil. And now Emma's come after me. And now Patters is skiving away from the whole, like, oh, don't not, don't execute me today. So since Patters can't be put on the block, I'm going to respond to all that by nominating Emma. All right, Emma, your response? Well, you know, Patters is my damsel, and I wanted to change him before he died. That was my only reason for keeping Patters alive. And now Patters has changed, so he doesn't want to die. Yeah, Correct. exactly. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. All right, there's five on Hazel. Six will put Emma on the block. Oh, you guys are really doing this because you don't like my DJ choices at night. <laughs> I, I, alive or dead, I can still link music and you guys can choose to listen to it or not. Two is not enough. Hazel's still on the block. <laughs> Final call. I've been listening. Uh, George Debbie nominates nominate. Bat. Oh, sorry. Oh, George nominates who? Bat. Whoa. Uh, Cat, you said? 
Uh, Dak, I was saying. Dak, sorry. Uh, not nice. <laughs> there we go. Why? Um, I kind of... I haven't... This is the first I've heard about the Dreamer stuff on Hazel, but I kind of socially trust her, I think. Um, I back... I gave uh, an interesting two on day one. I think I've heard half of it elsewhere, and I'm not sure I'm comfortable with the other half of it. Okay, Dak? Oh yeah, George, I lied to you. I gave the same I gave the same two to uh, batters, and I was neither of those roles, so... Um, I have shared my role with uh, one person. One person has figured out my role, um, or another person has figured out my role, and uh, I'm not the best cannibal food. Alrighty. Horrible cannibal food, actually. Five votes on Hazel, six will put deck on the block. All right, I'll give you one, George. I mean, here Hazel didn't even vote on their own, their own nominations. So. All righty, Hazel's still on the block. Any last nominations? Uh, Debbie will nominate Loki. Debbie has nominated Loki and dies. What is your prosecution? Interesting. Um, so Loki socially seems to be aligned with Patters and Cat, who are both bounty hunter pings. Okay, Loki. Uh, I don't know in what universe I'm. Uh, I'm. I'm. I'm suspicious of Patters or Hazel. I was just moving it on to Patters to see if we thought about anything about it. Uh, moving it over as Devil's Advocate because uh, he wanted to die yesterday. He didn't want to die today. So I thought about um, thought about that. So I don't know why I'm aligned with Patters and Hazel. Cat, not Hazel. All right. Cat. Oh. With Cat, yeah. All right, there are still five votes on Hazel. Six will put Loki on the block. Hey, guys, let's tie it since we got a death already. <laughs> no. Yes. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, the witch. So my, yes, thinking the is, witch. <laughs> my thinking is that Loki wanted to nominate somebody when Cat was on the block to try and lift that off and has been voting with Paz. End of the day in five. Mm. Oh, I guys, Paz is my Paz. damsel. Leave him alone. <laughs> yeah, he's, leave me alone, Debbie. Hazel he can't is executed rest, and, and dies. <laughs> and the game continues. Bum, bum. Wow, this whole last day was pretty good for Evil there. So they got Nick out of the way, and we got the... Uh, the witch curse, and then another good execution. So that was that was pretty good. Um, cool. So we are in seven player right now. Uh, yeah, our numbers changed quite a bit. There we go. So we're gonna go straight to Mary. Hello. Hello. So, <laughs> who, are you, who are you picking? God, I I regret revealing that I was Snake Charmer on day one. <laughs> yeah, that's a it's an interesting strategy. Um, I guess just out of curiosity, are you looking for the demon, or are you pressing your luck to find as many people who aren't? I'm pressing my luck. All right. <laughs> who would you like to pick? And I regret doing this because I wish I was just looking for the goddamn demon. Um, I'm going to choose Doc. Doc? Thank you. Wow, she has, she's gotten, uh... Although, who has she picked so far that's still alive? She picked... I think she picked Emma, if I remember right, and then Doc, and then Patters. So she knows that Tan Fan and George or Loki has to be the demon, assuming that she's sober. Um, I'm guessing she's going to stop picking people here real soon, but we'll see. Hello. Hey. Um, I don't think there's any suspicion on George, and I don't mind dying. I think I'm going to go for Emma. Emma it is. Thank you. 
still interesting choice there, but I guess it depends on if he's going to push on it or not. Uh, hello. Hello. Please select a player. Dak it is, please. Dak it is. Thank you. So surely by now, he must realize that Debbie must have been the sailor, right? Because a tea lady that protected Debbie before would have protected her again. So, uh, George. Hello. Hello. Please well, select a player. Yeah, this hasn't gone quite as I expected. I'm trying to work out how how Debbie didn't die now, and it's any all kinds of wacky scenarios. Um, I am going to kill Mary, please. Mary it is. Thank you. Cheers. Well, Mary got all of her... She, she just got straight info, and now she doesn't have to worry about it anymore. So, yep. Uh, nothing happened to Dak. Dead, dead. Go to Emma. Hello. You are... Oh, there you go. Wait. Oh, sorry. I was so surprised that I'm alive that I sort of unmuted and then I deafened yeah. back. And then I sort of undeafened and then... <laughs> I thought I was going to die. Nice to see I'm not. Alrighty. Would you like me to... Uh, yes, please select a player. <laughs> I really want... I want to choose George, but because Debbie thinks Loki is evil, I'm gonna go with what Debbie thinks because Debbie died with the witch and go with Loki so I'd like to dream Loki please alright Loki it is let's see am I finally gonna get a demon you learn that Loki is either the clockmaker or the devil's advocate another minion god <laughs> I'm the unluckiest dreamer. What is going on? <laughs> okay, thank you so thank much. Thank you. Yeah, I was trying to remember. I was like, I'm pretty sure he said Clockmaker 2. And, you know, the other Clockmaker will make that contentious later, but that's something that they can deal with. So, um, I don't know if George is bluffing. I think if if George gets picked, we're going to just say Monk because that's just an easy thing to just kind of throw on there. And I have no idea what Patters is doing. So, we'll just kind of get to all that when we get to that. Um, that appears to be it. <clears throat> um, come on. Uh, cool, that's everybody. Good morning, town. Mary has died in the night. Oh, thank goodness. I I... You. I'm so glad you died. <laughs> Me too. I was like, I think Mary's evil. <laughs> I would like... Sh shall I reveal my information? What do you think? Do it. You? Yeah. Do it. I was the snake charmer. Ooh. Playing loose and fast. Uh -huh. Because I revealed my... <laughs> my, my character night one. <laughs> Um, <laughs> um, so I chose Emma Night One. She, I, have, I haven't passed to anybody, so I chose Emma on the Night One, and then I chose Tanfana, and then I chose Patters, and then last night I chose Duck, but I guess it wouldn't proc, right? What are you? You got uh, probably yeah, no, so it. Yeah, goes first. So that's literally me or Loki, right, in that scenario? Um, okay. In that scenario, yeah, you or Loki. Yeah, unless I'm, like, drunk somehow, because there's a couple of different ways that could happen or whatever. Uh, but... Loki, can I talk to you? Sure. Whew! Mm. It paid off. How's it going? Why is my microphone going off? Okay, You're that's right? fine. No, sorry, I saw the green cycle. Um, I'm the dreamer. And I dreamt you last night. Okay. Do you, do you want to go three, two, one? Say the roll. Um, 
Sure. Or, or I mean, ha- I have you already told somebody, or I've told pretty much everyone. Um, I haven't no. been. Uh, I've been been hiding it. It's the first time we're talking. Yeah. Oh, I saw I, you. I saw you as clockmaker. Is that true? Yeah, that's what that I've been true? claiming to everyone. Are you clockmaker the clockmaker too? Yeah, clockmaker too. You are clockmaker too. Mm-hmm. What the? Okay. So George's demon. Hmm. From my perspective, I, I like I wasn't sure if I trusted Mary, but now that she's dead. This is a Vig and Mortis game, though. That's what I'm kind of thinking right now, because I don't see the, where the outsiders are. I've got one outsider. What, Pat? Yeah, my damsel. I've got my damsel, Patters, and another outsider. I don't consider Patters uh, as an outsider. He he is just my love, my my damsel love. Oh no, Loki left me. Welcome back. Yes, I I did pick you on night two uh, because of the you know, the back of the claim. Interesting. Um, okay. I pivoted to Hazel on night three because I thought he was claiming Tea Lady on you. Yeah. Um, apparently that's not a thing. Oh, is it not? Well, I mean, you died. Wasn't Hazel was already dead, right? Uh, no, it was before the, the thing went through. Oh, you're right. You're absolutely yeah. right. So, Good Hazel point. might actually have been evil. Uh, I don't think so. I, I don't think so either. Um, and she did claim not to tea to me. But yeah, I, the, I don't know the exact nature of the... Unless it was just a she hasn't been snake charmed yet accusation. Maybe. I, I don't know if that's what's happening there. Um... But yeah, I uh, and then last night I picked Havana because didn't really know. Uh, you see, okay. like. um, so I mean, I think we. Pat, this is probably not the demon. In the uh, no, it's probably not. I think Pat, is probably the witch. That makes sense. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I mean, I'm happy to to go for Loki. I think she might be the barber. Oh, then in which case, Stack is telling the truth and it's Emma instead. But it can't be Emma because Emma's the huntsman. Yeah, what they need now is. Uh, so it's, they need so George how does to survive stop? and then kill Dak. Wait, 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 that doesn't make sense. So what? Emma's the huntsman, so she can't be evil. Yeah, but what does uh, Tan being the barber make Dak? Well, Dak is the librarian who's confirmed a barber, I think. Oh, I see. Interesting. Or or one way around, or either one of those things. I think right, is true. right. Okay. Um, but, yeah, I'm just a little concerned that we haven't had any outsiders. Like, I, I'm an outsider, and Tan is a possibly an outsider. That's true. Yeah. So, no longer Vigor Mortis game, which explains why the minions aren't dead, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So, but then that would mean leech, which means we might have to kill you. You can kill me. I'm happy to do. We know I'm, if I'm gonna, you're telling I'm the gonna, truth. I'm going to nominate is somebody. Possible. I'm going to nominate somebody else if that's the case. But fair um, enough. I, we know Emma, if it's a leech game, isn't the target, so we don't nominate them. Yeah. But then we also. It's I also guess possible that Mary was a minion, Mary. and none of this is true. Yeah. No, I was just saying, I, I think there is, and I was saying the bounty hunter's uh, probably the one that's drunk. Just for guessing. Alrighty. <laughs> Alrighty, town. Don't say anything you don't want the class to hear. Uh, take a minute to chat, do any gossips if you want, and then nominations. Yeah, this might be a good moment to just get a general outside account. I don't necessarily need specifics of who's what, but uh, it could I be I believe it's, e- it's either two or one depended on whether you trust Dak. Hmm. Uh, do you, I, I'm the dreamer, by the way. Do you want me to share my information? Yeah, sure. Go for it. Yeah. Why not? You guys can help me clear this up. Oh, I saw Hazel as the witch, by the way, which I'm very confident that she is. Hold on, I just need to get my cat down <laughs> off the keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Luna. Hmm, okay. Know keyboard is the cats now <laughs> yeah cats are the best okay this is my dream info um, me and Mary had a conversation on day one first chat and then we hard claimed for each other 
Uh, I've covered the name of the person I did in I3 just because I don't know if they wanted to be outed as an outsider. But if they don't mind, I can just say, or I don't know. Uh-huh. But I haven't seen a demon yet. So from my perspective, George just has to be the demon. With Mary Snake Charmer info as well. Do you put the information in chat? Yeah, yes, in yes, game yes. chat. There we go, brilliant. I really like that night one you saw Kieran as grandmother or godfather and it's all just very familiar. Yes. And that's yeah. nice thematically. It's like flower girl or bamboo. It's all very... <laughs> yeah. So, Patters, if uh, Emma is the dreamer, how does that work with you getting changed by them into uh, whatever your new role is? Yeah, he's also my downside. I, I don't know why possible. Emma is now lying with dreamer info. I can't account for that. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Nomina oh. Nominations yeah, are open. Loki nominates Emma. Loki has <laughs> nominated Emma. Why? Eva. Uh, in I'm a clockmaker too, and in my world, I'm thinking that the evil team is uh, something along the lines of Emma, Nick, uh, Tim, Fana, and Cat as the evil um, townsfolk. Um, all this information is kind of uh, coming out of the out in the open. I think they're just trying to convey a world that it's either myself or George. And I, with uh, Nick's information that he's given me, I, it doesn't. I'm thinking more along of that thick Nick is evil. Whoa. Okay. okay. Uh, Emma? Uh, my defense is that I have been telling my information to Mary the whole game. Uh, I haven't changed what, like anything on my stance, and Mary can back me up on that. Um, if the majority of people do think I'm evil, then get me out of the way, that's fine. But I would rather go after demon targets from the snake charmer, which is Loki or George. Mm -hmm. I, I would... Oops, sorry. I 100% believe that Emma is good. I accidentally told Kieran that Emma was the dreamer earlier as well, so he can verify oh, that. I'm uh, so sorry. Yeah. Uh, that that <laughs> happened, but also, also Emma did cold call my role, so... <laughs> All right. If you Which... like to execute Emma, you need three votes. I'm so sorry. Wait, I would like to throw out there that the Please. clockmaker number is actually a one, and Loki is full of shit with that clockmaker, too. It's, I think Loki might just be the evil town. Hey, guys, that's we the evil team right now. Three. Also, Loki, uh, yeah, everything I told you was a lie. Three is good. Oh, Emma Dak. is on the clock. Dak nominates yeah. George. Dak has nominated George. Dak dies. What is your prosecution? <gasps> yeah. Oh, shit. Shit. That's not good. That's very uh, bad. Yeah. Uh, George uh, is in a double claim with uh, evil, evil, evil batters. So. What? Who? Hmm? Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not. Who? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm the I'm the damsel. <laughs> yeah, sure you are. George, your oh, defense. Okay. Um. <sighs> I it, understandable why I die here. Um, I voted for Emma because I was I've been thinking through. I can't see any way for the combination of the snake charm and dream information to be legit from my point of view. I totally mm -hmm. get that from the other point of view. Like I'm worth testing here. Um, but if nobody is playing Puzzle Master, it seems more likely to me that we just have some incorrect, like in a malicious way, info. Um, but sure, I'd go for it. All right, we have three on Emma. Four will put George on the block. I mean, Emma's world was that Hazel was the... Um, yeah. yeah. And she exactly. died of execution. We need so. to get five on this today, uh, and then we'll we get five on over it tomorrow. Only but five. Only five. On Emma. How was my info on Hazel wrong? Well, because the witch just killed him. Because Patrick is the Five is enough. George is on the block. Are there any right. Hazel would like to declare herself a minion and say Patters is the damsel and watch it not go off. Thank you. I'm no longer the damsel. I'll explain that to Thick Nick. I'm the monk. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> well, Patters is the witch because he was a second pick from the bounty hunter. Right. Like, it's unlikely that they're the demons. So Final I call. Kill Loki. But how, how would I have got wrong info on Hazel? That's my question. Because it's you no, it, drunk no I think it's Loki. Hazel, you, uh, Hazel Loki was nominates not Loki. misread by the dreamer and the gossip. Loki, nom oh wait, I've already nominated. Right, you tell me you won the gossip. Five seconds. No, I didn't. 
She, you said it in one of the public areas. Yeah, that's why I went for it. George is executed (laughs) and dies. Everybody, stay where you are, because the game is over and the good team is way. Oh, Hazel, if you were good, I'm so sorry. Let's do the let's do the roll call. Uh, Tanfana was your clockmaker who received a one. I don't know. I never heard that be outed at all. So, uh-uh. chat chat was wondering when that was gonna like explode into a big revelation. Just uh, now. Uh, did nobody hear me say that? Uh, just now. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Hazel was your gossip who gossiped three times. All of them were incorrect. Uh, Debbie was your sailor who night one picked Patters. Patters <laughs> was drunk. Debbie then picked Kieran, uh, who was drunk, and then Debbie was drunk on the third pick. And died to the witch. Aww. Kieran was the grandmother who saw Dak the barber. Cat was your evil cannibal, evil because of Nick the bounty hunter. Emma was your dreamer, and all of her picks here already posted. Mary was a snake charmer who never picked a demon. <sighs> Loki was the devil's advocate who picked himself. Uh, Emma, Patters, Emma. Uh, Patters was your witch who got two kills, I believe, and George was your Vigor Mortis. Bluffs were Monk, Puzzle Master, and Huntsman. Oof. Nice. And that was your game of Codependence Anonymous. Just oh. save the barber swap. Good game. My god. Wow. <laughs> I had penciled you in as the barber as well. That's very sad. Mm. <laughs> yeah, no, if um, we didn't kill that, we were going to have a big problem because it was like... Or evil just got a barber swap, so we don't know where it is anymore. Yeah, yeah. 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 Chat was a uh, chat was looking forward to that, but I, I I was considering a dat kill the previous night, but I was still hanging on to the vague hope that he might have been the snake charmer. Meanwhile, he goes and kills the snake charmer. <laughs> <laughs> yep. No, I I came out with the wild uh, what bounty hunter snake charmer first. first yeah. Day. You were so disappointed. And then uh, I went to I went to Kieran and we went to chat. Kieran's like, "Well, I didn't see you at that. I saw you as my grandchild, and I didn't see that at all." And I'm like, "Oh shit, I'm outed." So. <laughs> yeah, and the whole reason I didn't out that I was a clockmaker to many people is for the exact reason that Loki found himself claiming to be a clock two at the end. I'm like, "Okay, that's a minion." <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's what he claimed that to me as well. Yeah, that, that it's fine. I never told anyone, so you you could just go and say whatever you like. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I told like I told Debbie. I said uh, I said I'm a librarian who has seen yeah. uh, seen a barber, and she's like, okay, I'm just yeah. gonna just well, barber. Yeah, uh, Pat Patters did choose Dak on the first day, and you did nominate, but we kind of agreed that we wanted, you know, we we were gonna keep Debbie as sober at least for the one day to like one if she tests herself it's not immediately like oh I must have picked an evil person and also elite world was still possible, so yeah yeah that makes yeah. sense yeah why did you drink with me? Because it was a toss up between you <laughs> and Thick. <Finn. laughs> drink with Thick next time. Fucking that would have been so <laughs> more useful, insanely useful. Oh, yeah you for you. Thick. Yeah I know. <laughs> We're never thick. on the same team. Uh, oh, Actually, you only missed you only missed one. Uh, Two. Witch kill, it's fine. Oh no! I, I'd also witch kill, witch curse Debbie, um, <laughs> but she could not die that night. I think. <laughs> you're you're yeah. in the air at that. I, point. At, 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 at the time, I thought Hazel was the tea lady, and I really I thought, thought Kieran that, was the tea lady. I thought Andrew <laughs> had been like trying to kill um, <laughs> Debbie, and then realised, oh no, I can't. I thought yeah, it was just something in the voice that was uh, well picked. If I'm looking at my grim raid, I think everyone lied to me. Except for the last right. day. Uh, who's not in game two? I know Mary. Hey, Lydia, Loki. I, I, am not. Not. I, I am not. Uh, Thick, oh. you can you can take my spot, Thick. I no, I, I'm. I'm Are we gonna have Thick Nick good. and Nick Nick. No, I'm I'm not too many. I'm out. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks everybody for coming. Cheers for the game. Thank Bye. you. Thank you so much, Thanks. Andrew. Thanks Thank everyone. You. Oops. Bye. Where'd you go? Bye. Okay. Uh, all right, take you off. Let's. You gone. Okay. You guys can come down now. Uh, I believe Emma's leaving, so there you go. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Uh, is everybody else here signed up for game two also? Mm-hmm. Yep. Awesome. Okay, so 
it'll just be easier to do it this way. So yeah, Debbie, George. Somebody in a car. All right, cool. Karen, Loki, Nick, Ollie, Tan, Anna, and we're missing one. <clears throat> yeah, I think that was raving. Wasn't raving. It? Okay. Um. Said they can't make it. Yeah. I mean, if we have to do an 11, that's not the worst. As, I, as long as we can keep both games more or less uh, even. Um, let's see. Do we have a Grim Link, by the way? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll repost it. Uh, Lucky stuff, thank you. Uh, there you go. Going on here. Hey, Debbie, as someone who is watching yep. the stream, there we go. How how sus of Patters were you when you falsely claimed to him that he was your second bounty hunter pick? Oh yeah. Have you already sold like, him by then? Oh, I don't trust you. <laughs> okay, Patrick. <laughs> I am fairly sure we've never played a game of Clock Tower on the same team. Well, that can't be true, surely. I actually, yeah. <laughs> I don't. I cannot remember is, a single time. What is the stream name? I'd love to see what comment section we're saying. Uh, the stream is under. Um, let's see, it's. I'll just type it in the thing. It's Twitch. Just don't TV. don't click it yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll put a space so it's not an actual link. There you go. All right. Um, yeah, let's uh, we'll take a minute if anybody needs water or anything, and then we'll if we have twelve, cool. If we don't, also cool. So we will be right back. All right. Um, Oh boy. I wish I had done literally all of my night kills completely differently. <laughs> the, 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 one, the, the night kill on Nick when you didn't know that you were killing I, the bounty hunter was good. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah did I did not know he was the bounty hunter. Not a flipping clue. Oh, um, I was so I, sure that you'd sussed us out. At that no, point, George I was still. You were tea lady protected at that yeah. point. Oh, I had oh, a wacky sense. day one because I went from Debbie claiming bounty hunter to Nick claiming <laughs> bounty hunter. I was like, great, I've got two of them. Yeah. <laughs> it was I, I spoke to Nick like chat. a couple of days afterwards. Um, and I was like, I'm a little bit concerned that Kira might be my grandmother and I might have just confused the absolute crap out of the game. Um, because when I gave you bounty hunter, you had like a bit of a pause. And I was like, oh, was that not lining up with the information that you had? And then um, I spoke to Thick and I said that. The thick was like, yeah, well, I did tell Kieran that I was a bounty hunter, and uh, he immediately told me that it was a double claim, and I was like, oh, thick, that's not how roll swaps work. Yeah. Why have you the done this? The inspiration in your voice when you <laughs> said that was very funny. Yeah, I, 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 I think I messed up multiple people's roll swaps that game, <laughs> <laughs> just by talking to them. I I thought that um, he told me he Nick was uh, was the sailor, and I was like, okay, that's you know, I can believe that. Uh, so I, so then I went into the clock clockmaker. Uh, then when he died in the night, I was like, okay, so he must be lying to me. I want to go talk to him and see what's up. And then he said that he had been drinking with uh, with Patters. I was like, 
okay, I can see a world in which <laughs> that, that you make yourself like a sailor drum. So maybe he is the sailor. And so I was living off of that world the entire right, so, time. So just to be clear, the, when the bounty hunter got Patters as the ping, the person they were in a real swap with claimed to have got Patters as the ping. And then when the sailor, who was the other half of that role swap, self drunk by drinking with Patters, oh, it was the awesome. bounty hunter also <laughs> claimed to have yeah. self drunk by drinking with Patters. That's yeah, no, chat were chat was going crazy because yeah, the uh, the sailor was like, oh, my ping was Patters, and we're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure you I, didn't just actually receive the wrong tokens? I think I, th I, I think there was a hashtag nerf Debbie in the chat. So, oh, definitely. Um. Okay. All right. Uh, nobody responded, so I think we'll just go with an eleven-player game. No need to drag it out. Um, so, script two is the drunken disorderly version two, uh, which is in the I believe it's in resources. Yes. Uh, so you can grab that. Uh, we're going to go set up. Uh, everybody has the Town Square link. Uh, it's in the game chat. All right. Okay, hello, everybody. Thanks for your patience. Uh, do remember that there will be a voting link at the end of the stream. So keep that in mind. Okay, so here are some of the notes uh, from the author of Drunk and Disorderly about what they changed. Uh, they switched having a Puka and a Vortox into having a Fangu and a Drunk. The reason was that they thought that the Puka was too easy to identify. Vortox games would lessen the intended confusion. Uh, Fangu utilizes hidden outsiders more effectively. Uh, drunk also adds to this while hiding the Fangu plus one. Also, Evil may not be expecting a jump when it happens, uh, probably due to the poppy grower. Uh, they traded the Witch for the Godfather. Godfather is a more consistently useful minion but it also helps the town identify outsiders through the additional night death. Um, Cordier was switched out for Pixie. Cordier doesn't strictly provide information and can be volatile. Uh, they saw that there's a lot of double claims, so why not lead into that? Alchemist was swapped out for Poppy Grower. Poppy Grower was so confusion for the evil team. Alchemist overall was less useful for the town than the Poppy Grower was. So those are all the changes uh, that the script author made. Um, there we go. All right, so I have the link ready, which again, we will post the voting link at the end of the stream, so please stick around for that. Um, uh, somebody's asking about randomizing seats. I guess I'll just do that now. There we go. All right, so let's pull this up, choose an assign. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. Fangu Godfather Poisoner with a Politician. Although we have to do, we can either leave it at one outsider and do a plus one with the Fangu and minus one for the Godfather. We can also do a plus two if we really wanted to uh, stretch it out quite a bit like that. Um, but the Poppy Girl will be kind of fun with that, so. I feel like, ooh, with the Fangu, I kind of do want more outsiders, especially if they're going to be like blindly guessing where they're going to jump to. So I think let's. Hmm, I kind of want to swap Godfather for something else, and then just do a plus one outsider, and then that have that be all the changes. Could do a pit hag. Saranovis with a pixie. That could be a good combo there. Yeah, let's do a let's do like our only swap will be Saranovis for Godfather to help tie in with the pixie, and that allows our Fangu to go a plus one, and they can have a little more fun, kind of blindly guessing. Uh, let's put in a damsel and remove a. We have a poisoner. That's the only thing that would trigger a mathematician. So, I don't think that's going to be as useful. Okay, and then Politician, it's still kind of like you can play for both sides in a way. So, I think that works. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It's George again. 
Uh, well, it's on stream. It's random. Flusts are going to be chambermaid. Philosopher. And... And mathematician. I played with one guy, George, was a good demon last time. He, yeah, George, George, George's got it. Okay, um, what is our prep? So, I have to remember that, you know, let me just put a... I know the guess hasn't been used yet, I just, I'm gonna put a token on here to remind myself to tell them about it. Um, Noble is going to see Tanfana, Debbie, and JC. Clockmaker is going to get a two. Oh, well then maybe we don't want to put, uh, maybe we don't want Tanfana in there if they're going to be in the Clockmaker. Um, Pixie is going to see I feel like everybody would usually just do poppy grower, so I kind of want to do... Let's give them an, abil an ability that they actually are going to want to have. Um, okay, Savant's kind of fun. We get a lot of... Whoops. Uh, there we go. We get a lot of chaos with all of these uh, long sentences of abilities. And let's see if Dreamer can kind of solve it again like they did last time. Um... Okay, I think we're good. Wouldn't be able to coordinate that. Alrighty, town, we ready? Uh, someone yeah. just dropped out of the chat. Hazel. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, ooh, that's a. Uh, oh, yeah. Hazel hasn't taken a seat either. Yeah. Might be Did having he connection problems. Pat is in Loki round, so Pat is a new instance of the DA. I'm sorry, what? You have been protected twice, right? I had, uh, um, cool. I protected Patters last time. Uh, yeah, but I'm... Oh, if, if they had swapped? Yeah. Then the original the original DA protection would disappear. Because, yeah, so it would yeah. count as a new instance, right? So in the world where George is DA protected on that final day, mm -hmm. you barber swap, barber swap your minions, and... Oh, and get then you can protect again. the other guy again, yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh? Oh, is that how it works? It doesn't. You can you can protect the same person if it's a different person if they swap the roles. Yeah, um, do it. It's it, yeah, it's all kind Ooh. of just a timing thing. But um, okay, uh, where is he? We got our eleven. Okay, yeah, we'll just get going. We're like twelve minutes early, but gonna send you to your cottages. Uh, Hazen likes to take a seat. I do. Okay, I will do that. Ah, uh, 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 there I am. Alrighty. One person didn't move yet. Um. Hello, George. Uh oh. Not again. You know how everything is random, right? Yeah. Ah, love this for me. Okay, at least I can bug out. Uh, so since we're here, we'll just give you your info. Your bluffs are chambermaid, philosopher, mathematician. Fantastic. And that is all I have for you. Brilliant! Thank you. All right, cheers. Well, good. It's good to have fun. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh, hello. How's it uh, going? Good. I am here to tell you that I have no info to give you, but I will grab your poison while I'm here. Oh, that's fun. Um, let's poison Debbie. Debbie it is. Thank you. Thank you. 
Um, got a little ahead of myself there, but yeah, they are the first person that I go to in the night order. So now we'll go to Tanfana and basically the same thing. Um, actually, the Poisoner's already gone, so I think we could do the Damsel now, too. Hello. Hello again. I also want to let you know that there is a Damsel in play. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Um, as far as your info goes, there is a damsel in play. And that's all I have. Ouch. Please select a player and a role. Debbie Politician. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. I mean... <laughs> Okay. I mean, I guess I don't even need a note for that, really. Um, all right, well. Hello, Debbie. Hello. I am here to let you know that the Saranovis has selected you to be mad. Okay. You are mad today that you are the politician. Oh, fantastic. Thank you very much. Thank you. I mean, all right. JC. Hello. Hello, hello. You learn that there is a savant in play. Oh, that's a fun one. Um, how do you run madness? Do I need to actively be claiming savant to people, or do I need to leave people with the impression I could be a savant, if that makes sense? Um, I always tend to run it where, you know, you should be playing as if you are and always have been the savant. Um, if you put, like, a savant in a two and it's kind of a situation where that would make sense to do if you were actually the savant, that's fine. I, I'm not expecting you to be like, no, like, all, all things aside, I'm telling you now I'm the savant, always have been, always will, you know. Like, you don't have to be so in your face, like, obviously, he's mad kind of thing, you know. Awesome. Um, and is that also yeah. true if I'm made mad by the Serenovus later, or? Uh, yeah, kind of more or less in the same in the same vein. Lovely um, stuff. Yeah, so I mean, play play as if you were actually that role. Um, awesome. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thank Thanks. Yeah, madness is always tricky. The fact that it's like one of the only things that is like entirely or just about. Uh, Storyteller's discretion. Um, we already did the damsel stuff. Clockmaker. Hello, Nick. What's up? You are this game's clockmaker, and you receive a two. Awesome, thank you. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. Oh, I think I am going to pick George. George. Let's see. You learn that George is either the Fangu or the Snake Charmer. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Well, what are you going to do? Um, Loki. Hello. Howdy, howdy. Your three names. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce this one. It's Lydris, Lydris. Mm, yep. I'll do a confirmation on that, but them. Uh, JC and Debbie. JC, Debbie. All righty. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. Hello, one more thing. How would I pronounce your username? Uh, Lydris. Lydris, got it. Thank you. Awesome, thank you. Got it. Um, all right, that is all of our net info. Um, very interesting showing from Evil so far. We'll uh, see what happens. But the, the blind jumping, I think, will be pretty fun. He's got two targets to choose from. So we'll see what happens.
Good morning, town. Wouldn't you know it? I've been murdered again. Um, Dang. It is up to you. You are my Scooby gang. Go out there and solve this for me. Can I make a public Scooby announcement snacks first? Oh, uh, I'd like to make a public announcement first, if that's okay. I'm the damsel. Minions come at me. Mm -hmm. Uh, put that in the grimoire. Whoa, wonderful. Do you want to go to chat? Uh, sure, why not, Ollie? Andrew, could I get my Savant info, please? I will be down below. Why not be bold faced about it? Really? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Cool. I look forward to making up whatever this info is going to turn out to be later. I mean, that's kind of how a lot of STs run Savant anyway. That's so. very true. Uh, let's give it another five seconds, though, I guess. Ooh, yeah, that's really interesting info. I'm going to have to think about that. Thank you very much. Not a problem. That's a good point, Chad. If you could think of any uh, good Savant info, just pop it in. Pretty good. How are you? I am uh, feeling a lot more on the benevolent side, uh, feeling a lot more uh, blue, feeling a lot more goodness, uh, definitely. Me too, me too. De oh, definitely. Good to hear. Good to hear. Good to hear. Um, do you, what do you want to exchange? Uh, I'm open. Want to do a three for three? Yeah, I'm fine with that. Sure. Yeah. I will tell um, you that I am either the... Um, I'll go with uh, Noble, Chambermaid, or Savant. Awesome. Noble, Chambermaid, or Savant. Awesome. Uh, I'll say I'm either the Noble, Mathematician, or Minstrel. Uh, noble, Mathematician, or what was that last one? Yeah, Savant. there's yeah, there's a bunch of things you don't want to claim and a bunch of people who'd want to cover for those people. Yeah, um, that makes sense. But um, yeah, if you find somebody who wants to like do like weird things that that check me, I'm happy to be checked by whatever things, and then uh, give out info as befits that. But for the time being, just kill him. Okay, understandable. All right, cheers, Thank you very much, Judge. Whatever you want, that's fine. I can go for a two. Sure, why not? Uh, you want me to go first? Uh, sure. I should probably fit, pick what. <laughs> <laughs> pick what two lies you're going to tell me. Yeah. Um, yeah, 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 I, yeah. I will tell you uh, mathematician or philo. Hello. Hello. S suppose you want some info. I do indeed. I'd like some information. Alrighty. Uh, here are your two bits of info. One is true and one is false. Firstly, uh, maybe we should prepare that a little more. Firstly, one player was affected by three abilities last night. <laughs> one player was affected by three abilities. Or, one player changed their ability last night. One player changed their ability. Ooh, okay, cool. Thank you for that. Thank you. So, you know, don't give them too much to work with right off the bat, and also that's going to help sell that Philo bluff later on. So. Cool. I will tell you that I am either the goon, politician, or a uh, poppy grower. Ooh, or Poppy. Okay, cool. Got anything else you'd like to say to me now? Um. No, 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 no. Um, I like I like the three. I'm I'm fine for doing a one for one with people. Thank you, Debbie. Thanks. You know me. Hmm. Yeah. I'm all about them visiting the storytellers because I'm Savant or Amni. I mean, that checks out. You have visited the storyteller. I yes. believe you are, critically. Wonderful. 
Um, yeah, if I'm the savant, I'm holding the info to myself for a day or two. And if I'm the Amni, I did not wake up last night and just received a cold. So that's fun. Okay, good to know. Um, uh, if, if you're the mathematician, do you have a number that you're willing to share? Uh, Want to give me your number? or? Sure. Do um, uh, you want to tell me what you are first? Oh, yeah, sure. I'm the politician. Um, I'm just going around asking everybody why I should play for their team. Okay. That's well, fair. I got a two. Do as you will. Okay. And you should play for the good team because there's eight of us, potentially, and only three of them. So you want more people to win, right? Do you know what? That's a fair point. Yeah. You could help eight people win instead of three. Nick, I'm going to be honest. I'm more inclined to go after your campaign um, because so far you're the only person that's given me a real reason. So I respect that. Thank you, Debbie. I'll let you know if that changes. <laughs> All right. Sounds good. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yep. Bye. Bye. Oh. Yeah, that's always a good thing. Oh, yeah. Uh, um, sure. What do you want to do? Uh, did, you, did you wake up in the night? Uh, who knows? Who's asking? Uh, I will tell you that uh, I am either the uh, chambermaid or the noble, and so I would like to know if you uh, woke up tonight. Yeah, I woke up. Why not? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Very cool. Okay. Obviously, I woke up in the night. Um, do you want to give maybe like a three possible roles you could be? Uh, sure, why not? Uh, I will tell you that I am either the dreamer, the innkeeper, or the mathematician. Or the mathematician. Oh, cool, 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 cool. Uh, fair enough, that sounds reasonable. Um, I will tell you that I'm the philo that hasn't used it yet. Okay, please don't philo into philosophy. Uh, not philosophy. Yeah. <laughs> don't, don't philo into your own ability because you will be drunk and that would be awkward for you. Yeah, that would be. I could, yeah, have an infinite chain of drunk philos. Uh, <laughs> uh, what sort of info uh, exchange do you fancy? Uh, I've been doing three for three. So are you good with that? Uh, yeah, sure, I can do three. I'll have to think up a third one because I've not done more than two yet. But I'm sure oh, that's possible. Okay. okay. <laughs> cool. Um, I'm either the noble, the mathematician, or the minstrel. Um, I've heard of all three of those, but none of them hard claims. Um, yeah. I will give you... I am either the... Uh, uh, okay, let's say savant, amnesiac, or philosopher. Okay. Savant, Amnesiac, or Philosopher. Perfect. Yes. I definitely didn't just read off three roles in a row. I'm definitely one of them. Uh, All right. Uh, let's let's see. see. I think we're out of time. We are out of time. Oh. Hello, town. Let me just confirm. Uh, hello. I have an announcement I'd like to make. Cool. No, mm -hmm. no gossips and no jugglers, so go ahead. Okay, cool. My announcement is that there's a poppy girl on the script, and Tanfana declaring herself to be the damsel come at me, I thought was a signal that she was a um, minion trying to signal to other minions. And so I called her bluff, and she came out to me as a Sarah Novus who made T um, Debbie mad that they are the politician. And I told Tan that I poisoned her last night by not knowing, so... Um, we have our Saranovas and Tan. Ooh. I think Ooh. we might have your poisoner, though, as well, though, if that's true, because I wasn't made bad. Really? So, this awkward well, now, thing is, it? You were made mad, because when you went after Tan after me, I was like, shit. Tan's <laughs> going to be like, what? And Deb's going to be like, what? And they're going to figure out that I lied to Tan. <laughs> this is probably not part of the conversation to have today, right? <laughs> this is a... Well, this is a <laughs> We, we can ask Debbie tomorrow if they were made mad. Yeah. I can let you know right now that I'm not mad. I am the politician. I've spoken to a selection of people and asked why I should play for their team. And I'm going to be honest, Hazel, probably not going to be playing for yours. 
<laughs> Ooh. Nomination. Oh, it's two of them. Uh, JC nominates Tantana. Prosecution, please. That thing, what Hazel said. Um, <laughs> there might be other things people want to go after, but we should definitely at least get six on this based on that. All right, Tanfana. Um, I'm not actually the Sarah Novas. I'm not actually the damsel either. Um, I just kind of played along with Hazel just for funsies. And chat was actually the one that suggested that I lie about uh, Sarah Novas being mad Debbie as a politician. But since they're not Sarah mad, I'm clearly not the Sarah Novas. All right. If you want to execute Tanfana, you need six votes. Had you spoken to Debbie before your conversation with Hazel? No. She could still be mad and just came out as thing to get executed and further prove it. Uh, I mean, I believe, I believe Debbie is the politician, but we can talk about it more tomorrow, probably. Tanfana yeah. is on the block. Are there any more nominations? Debbie will nominate Hazel. Debbie nominates Hazel. Why? I think getting rid of the Poisoner earlier will be a lot better than getting rid of the Serenovus. Okay, Hazel. If I'm the Poisoner, why would I throw the Serenovus under the bus? Okay, there are eight votes on Tanfana. Nine will put Hazel on the block. Because minions are expendable. Sarah Novus versus Poisoner. Which minion's better to keep in play? Oh, I find the Sarah Discuss Novus. below. Um, Sarah <laughs> Novus is the kind of content you want. Four is not enough. Mm -hmm. Tanfan is still on the block. Final call. I would say long term, the Poisoner is more damaging. But in the short term, let's just make information plainer. <laughs> no, I think I trust you. Tanfan is executed and dies. Game continues. I mean, <clears throat> that's that's definitely that's definitely very uh, brutal for evil. But if a player was made mad, and they argued, "No, I'm not mad. I'm this." Like that's, I think, I think that's perfectly in line with, you know, actual madness. Like you can't confirm that you're mad, basically, and she's not doing that. So uh, that really just comes down to an unfortunate slip up. Uh, from Tanfana and Hazel's conversation uh, where it was outed and unfortunately that's that's uh, I mean what are you going to do so uh, let's keep going at least we still have Debbie as a potential pseudo evil player so it's not completely out the window yet um, don't do it with Hazel Vydris Hello. Hello. Please select a player. Uh, I'll choose Kieran today. Kieran it is. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, that's a good one. Um, yeah, Debbie, Debbie's doing... I mean, while well, just claiming their role due to the madness, they're just kind of doing what a politician does. It's just make everything super complicated and just, you know... Have fun, and then fix the side you want to win with, if you're doing it right. Uh, George. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. Please well, select a player. Yeah. I, uh... I mean, I've heard of a Clockmaker 2, and I was already suspicious of the downfall game and Tapana, so I'm pretty sure that Clockmaker 2 is legit, and uh, my Serenovus is dead, which is a shame. So, I'm now going to try and paint Ollie as the demon as hard as I can, I guess. Um, so, let's go for... Who might be a poppy grower? Uh, you know what, screw it. Let's just go for JC. JC? Yep. Alrighty, thank you. Um, if a, if by the end of a game, if the politician is poisoned, then they don't have the ability to win with evil, so 
that 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 would be funny. Um, but uh, yeah, I guess that, that that's a good question about if the moment that they were considered the most like the reason that the uh, good team won or or lost rather, um, if they were poisoned, then it's hard to say. But um, but the the end of the game is when they change alignments. So I think if uh, if they're poisoned at the end of the game then they're just SOL, but, um, okay, yeah, so we still have Debbie who can play on evil side, George can still jump, they have two options to do so, so it's not, we're not doing too bad, we don't even have to pay attention to Madness anymore, so, um, it's four, nothing but five, Kieran we get to lie too, so let's do that. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. I would like to look at Loki, please. Loki. You see that Loki is either the poisoner or the goon. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Uh, what will our savant info be? We could do something where there are zero evil dead players, because there's going to be two dead players tonight, but that could be a little too on the nose. It's hard to say. Um, so we maybe we do, there is a... There is a poppy grower in play, or uh, there are no dead evil players. Well, hmm. if that's right, then the poppy grower can't be right, and then that could just be Hazel throwing on the bus. But I think they might just assume that that means, oh, the poppy grower is in play, and the other part's the lie. So maybe that doesn't work as well. We have a minute to think about it. If you got to think of any savant info, uh, do uh, do drop them in the chat. One more. There we go. Good morning, town. JC has died in the night. Okay. Uh, Debbie, are you still the politician? Yeah. I oh, wasn't okay. lying yesterday. I, was, I wasn't made bad. Alright. Uh, Kieran, can I talk to you? Yeah, sure. Why not? Alright. Oh. There we go. Okay. Hello. Hello. Uh, would you like to do a hard claim by any chance? Uh, I don't know. Why? Do you want to do a hard claim? Yes. Sure, why not? Uh, I'll go first. Uh, I'm the clockmaker. Okay. Uh, I'm the dreamer. Dreamer. Alright, what... Do you uh, want to share info? I mean... Need to confirm some stuff first, I think, but okay. before sharing too much. All right. I'll uh, I'll tell you I got a I got a two. Interesting. Yeah. Fair. Uh. I think maybe after today, after tonight. I'm yeah, some fair enough. Useful information. Well, as we have a storyteller conveniently here, I'm happy to duck out of the way so you can potentially get some information. <laughs> cool, no worries, thank uh, you. All right, thanks, Ollie. I'll catch you later. Cheers. Hello, Hello. Andrew. Information, please. Yeah, let's go with... There are no dead evil players. 
Okay. Or the outsider count has been altered. Yeah, that, that was waiting for that one to turn up eventually. Outsider count has been altered. Amazing. Good. Thank you for that. Thanks. That's useful. Cheers. So, the logic behind that is Cat's not coming out. So, if Debbie's the only one that is stern, like I am the outsider, then they might think that that part's the lie and maybe the dead evil players is true. It's hard to say. Yep. Okay. And I haven't gotten any hard feelings yep. on anyone. And I have yet to talk to Lydris, mm -hmm. so um, that leaves us where we're at. Um, would I be able to get a three for three from you guys? Sure. Ooh. Uh, so yeah, I'm either the, yeah, noble, like I said, mathematician or minstrel. I am either the goon, oh. the poppy grower, or the snake chopper. Okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, uh, I'm just the politician. I can <laughs> give it to you three times, but... <laughs> It's what it okay. is. We can spare the time. <laughs> yeah. No, all good, all good. So I'm sorry, Cat. Noble, oh, noble math and minstrel. Yep, I know noble you said math twice. And minstrel. All right, cool. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Cool. Thank you. But who yeah. knows? Who I, knows? Maybe. maybe I, I just kind of trust Hazel. She's done that before when she's good. No, fair enough. No, that sounds reasonable. Yeah. Cool. All right. Cool. All right, let's have it. Cheers. One, one, one person affected by three. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So if there is a Sarah, uh, I've like I've heard a number of abilities which could affect us. So I'm leaning more towards the first one than the second one because I've not heard any other than your claim with Philo and other person's claim with Philo. I've heard no other one use, like what potential to change abilities. Right. So, yeah. Um, today's is no dead evil players or the outside account has been altered. Outside account altered. Thank you very much, Holly. Cool. No worries. All right. Cool. Cheers for that, Nick. Mm -hmm. That is one of the most fun threes I've heard in a good while. Um, I I will keep it nice and simple. I am either a savant, an amnesiac, or a pixie confirming a savant or an amnesiac. Okay, that works for me. That actually very much plays. Okay, cool. Thank you. Apparently, Loki's waiting to chat. And I right, said you later. Okay, take care. Um, what would you like to do in two stories? Um, I will just give you my hard claim, and I'm happy for you to give whatever you want back. Okay, cool. What's your hard claim? Uh, I'm, I am the politician. <laughs> you are actually the politician? <laughs> yep. Oh, wow, okay. Have you settled on which way you're swinging at all, or just going Not by? really. I think I'm just going to gather as much information as I can, and then go from there. Fair enough. That makes sense. Um, cool. I'll give you either Amni or Savant, then. Okay. Thank you very much. You are welcome. Ah, uh, fair enough. Yeah, not not a philo pixie. So not I, a philo pixie. Yeah, I can't confirm you yet. <laughs> um, no. Have you used your ability yet? Or are you holding? No, I am. Um, I was going to use it last night, but I've heard of minstrels, and given. The, the sus on Tanfana possibly being a minion. I, I thought mean, it was wise to hold, just in case. Yeah, that's fair. Obviously, from my perspective, either Tanfana is not a minion, or there is no minstrel in play, because I died yeah. last night, and there's literally no way yeah, that yeah, can yeah. happen. No, exactly, game. exactly. Um, but yeah, I ha obviously had no way of knowing that at the time, so it was a yeah. just in case, I think, prudent caution. But Ooh. yeah, I, I, I want to try and get it off sooner rather than later, mm. I think. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, I imagine there's something better, but Pixie is now available. Yeah, I mean, 
Tanfana had suggested going Poppy Grower. Um, she was adamant it was a Poppy Grower game, um, and it never hurts to double up because yeah. if you kill one, you, you know, you've got a backup. But who knows? Yeah, that's very true. And none of these. Uh, the the only problem is if it's not a Poppy Grower game, I guess. Certainly from yeah. the what Hazel and uh, Tanfana were saying. Uh, well, yeah, from how that shook out on day one. Yeah, that implied it is a poppy grower, but it's a complete yeah. waste to turn into it if it isn't. So no, indeed, absolutely, it's it's a risky gambit, but who knows? Uh, Andrew, since you're in the chat, quick question on that, I guess. Um, sure. If we hypothetically, if we execute the poppy grower today, and then tonight Lydra be load into a poppy grower, would the uh, evil team learn who each other is? in like the gap in between since there was a bit of the game where there wasn't a poppy grower in play. I guess since the poppy grower is sober at the point they die, they'd still learn it. Mm-hmm. Excellent question. Uh... I think the answer is they'd still learn it. But based I, I'm just thinking based, I, I, so I'm, I looking, think I'm, the... I'm, I'm looking at the looking at the script. Um, the text of Poppy Grower says if you die they learn who each other are that night. So I think based on the wording at the moment they die, it's already triggered that they're going to learn. I think that's yeah. how it works. Yeah. I, th- I think if that happens, the, the first like the, thing the that happens and the, the night the becomes, the, 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 the ability becomes active the moment they die. Yeah. That, that, I think oh. how I would rule that. No, it's good to know. Um, and we're coming back to town now, too. Lovely stuff. Thank okay. you both. Great, thank you. Alrighty, town. Take a minute to chat, and then I'll open. Uh, Hazel, can you, do you mind sharing exactly, um, um, exactly what happened when you talked to Tanfana? Um, if you'd like. So, she made, I'm a damsel, minions come at me. Mm-hmm. And so I went in to private chat and I said, yay, evil team. And she was like, and she was like, oh, and I said, so which one are you? Mm-hmm. And she was like, huh, what? What did you just say? And I said, which one are you? She said, I'm the Saranovitz. And I said, cool, I'm the Poisoner. And I actually poisoned you last night. So who did you try to make bad but not successfully make bad? Mm-hmm. Um, that's how the conversation went. And then we decided that, yay, we found a teammate. And we tried working on finding our other teammate. And we and she, Did she answer when you asked? Who you... Answer what? Yes. She, she said, be politician. Um, as a matter of fact, she did, um, and then Debbie spoke to her next, so I kind of worried about that, and then I kind of stopped paying attention because I just kept playing, um, with everyone I talked to, I tried to get a vibe off of them, whether or not (coughs) they were looking for their evil teammates. I asked them Mm -hmm. about what they thought about Tenfana's opening play as a kind of way to gauge, um, and that's kind of how my day went until I revealed all at the top of nominations. Okay. Well, um, sorry. Lucky. I would like to share that I I'm the noble, and my pings were Lydris, JC, and Debbie. Um, and I found it kind of interesting that when Tanfana counter nominated Hazel, that the exact people that voted on it were Lydris, JC, Tanfana, and Debbie. That feels more of a curio than anything else, because right. your your information would say exactly one of us is evil anyway, right? Yeah, but that means that unless I'm Unless the poisoner got me, that at least one minion was trying to like was was voting on Hazel. Um, it just kind of seems like it seems more likely that that means that a uh, minion was trying to get Tanfana off the block. I'm gonna butt in real quick. Nominations are open, but keep chatting. I apologize. I my son is urgently trying to get my attention. I will be right back. I'm sorry. One thing I just wanted to quickly highlight um, because uh, multiple people gave me soft claims of minstrel on day one. Um, if you, any of you actually are the minstrel, then Tamfana is categorically not a minion because I died last night. Um, yeah. And if none of you are the minstrel, then please do come and let me know what you actually are. I'm probably good here. And from my perspective, unless Hazel is specifically the poisoner, Tamfana can't be the Serenobus because I wasn't made mad yesterday. I am just the politician. Hmm. Mm. Should a minstrel come out right now? Because I feel like that's 
important information right now, or is that, yeah. uh, or is that too, or is that too much? Uh, if, I, if I were a minstrel and I'd seen somebody die of night, I would probably not be uh, coming out right now because yeah. I would be worrying about being drunk. Yep, yep, yep. In fact, if right. anyone cares, it, my cat was doing something utterly hilarious, and my son just insisted I see it before it ended. I'm sorry. About that. About I'm like, that. there are like 300 people waiting for me to answer a question. You're, uh, <laughs> you're, 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 you're just in time for our second call for nominations. We would like to know what the cat was doing now. Um. <laughs> just being cute, doing that thing where they twist their head and put their paws in the air. Oh. <laughs> um. One quick addendum to what I said, by the way, um, I realized that the minstrel could still be in play in that world, but they would be sat next to an Odashi or have been, oh no, I guess just sat next to an Odashi. Okay. Um, Hazel oh, nominates Hazel. Hazel nominates Hazel. Why? Uh, because, as I have been telling everybody, I am either the goon or the snake charmer or the poppy grower. Um, so I feel that any of these make me a good execution, and I'd rather be taken out by town um, or turned evil at night. Uh, so that is the options before you. Um, if you guys think I'm the poppy grower and think it's a menstrual day, kill me. If you guys think I'm the snake charmer, kill me. If you guys think I'm the goon, kill me. All right. If you want to put Hazel on the block, you need five. Mechanically, it cannot be a menstrual day because I died at night. There's nothing that could make that happen in a menstrual day. Oh. I guess other than a very, very weird niche amnesiac. I think this is useful for like cutting off a couple of angles of how I guess they could have gone dynamically. Seven is enough. Hazel is on the block. Final call for nominations. Hazel is executed and dies. Game continues. Good night. Well, it was a bold play, but yeah. Um, there's no feel anyway, so that whole hypothetical doesn't matter. Um, I guess let's go inform our evil team. Hello there. Hello. Before I get your pick, would yep. you like to know your evil team? I would love to. Your fellow minion is Tanfana. Awesome. Your demon is George. Double awesome. Uh, Thank and you while very I'm much. here, I will take your poison. I will poison Ollie. Ollie, it is. Thank you. Cheers. All right, Poisoner, Poisoner hit the politician first, and that was kind of like, a, oh, that's too bad. Really good picks so far after that. Um, hello. Uh-oh. Would you like to know your actual evil team? Oh, yeah, sure. Your fellow minion is Lydris. And your demon is George. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Hello. Hello. Before I get your pick, would you like to know who your minions are? I would love to know how minions are. Your fellow minions, or your minions rather, are Tanfana and Lydris. Incredible. Uh, thanks for that, Hazel. Not sure why you did that, but I'm a huge fan. Uh, I'll go ahead and get your pick while we're here. Okay, right. So, that kink is a few things. Um, Out of curiosity, uh, were you... Who, who were you... Or I guess, if your choice has changed, who were you going to pick? I I was going to pick Cat, and I probably still will. I was gonna definitely going to take hit outside the Noble Pings. I thought uh, either no Loki was the Noble or also the Clockmaker too, and so it was a bad kill regardless for me. Um... Kieran had claims to have dreamt me as not the philosopher, so I'm going to put him down as possible mutant or drunk. Um, so I want to say that for later. 
Debbie may or may not be the actual politician, but either way, I want her on my team. Um, so I think, yeah, the choices are really Cat or Nick if I want to keep Ollie open as a clockmaker too from Tanfana. So I'm going to go for Cat. Cat it is, thank you. And there it is. Hello, Kat. Hello. Oh, hi. How, how's, how's the damsel life? I'm scared. I'm really scared. No, you're not having a good time? Especially when there's, there's, no, no, husband. there's no husband on the script? <laughs> it took me a while to figure that out. And I was like, oh, I'm just, oh. I'm just a sitting duck. Cool. <laughs> well, good news, potentially. Oh, okay. You are the Fangu. You are evil. Okay. Thank you. No, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thanks. Yeah, there we go. Um, let's see, so now we got Kieran, and we can lie to Ollie, so that's going to be fun. Uh, let's get Kieran. Hello. Hello. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah. It's funny how I... these things work out. Yeah. I'd like to look at Debbie, please. Debbie. You look at Debbie and see that they are either the Fangu or the politician. Thank you. Thank you. No, a jumped Fangu does not learn their evil team, but George will die and he'll know exactly what happened and he can go talk to her. Um, let's see. I could, you know, I, I didn't really think about it. That's kind of a good pick, giving Debbie as also the Fangu politician, because if she's such a noted outsider and they think it's a Fangu, then Debbie's always going to be a target for that. So that, that dream will help with it. Um, yeah, I'm excited to lie to Ollie. That's fun. Um... Yeah. Yeah, Cat would have learned the evil team if Taylor died a day later. Yeah. Um, okay. That's that's all we got. Um oh whoops. Wrong channel. There we go. Just gonna get Nick up here. There we go. Good morning, town. George has died in the night. Uh, okay, uh, heads up, everyone. Uh, I was the philosopher Poppy Grower. The evil team might now know who their, their team is. Hmm. Um, I, I, I had a claim of philosopher somewhere else. Well, they were lying to you. And as your snake charmer, I clear first Tan and then Debbie from being the demon. Well, you guys can go. Well, chat that now. settles that then. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. uh, Ollie, could we have a quick chat? Uh, Cat, you want to chat? Yep, I'll follow you, JC. Sure. Who is that? Uh, Loki. Yeah, sure. Let's go. Yay. Yay. Hey, how's it going? Pretty good. How are you? Doing well. So, did you, uh, were you either the math mathematician or the minstrel? Uh, I am the mathematician, not the minstrel. You're the mathematician with a zero. Yep, I've gotten a zero every night. Okay. Mathematician. So, it's possible I'm next to a Nodashi, I guess. Well, or if you believe like me, that. then it's likely not. Um, um I, it, I don't know. What's what's your information? Uh, that my noble pings are. Uh, I'm sorry. That yeah. That I, I forgot. I hadn't oh, told right. you the noble. Uh, I told I told probably you, but yeah, Elijah's and J C and Debbie, and so it's likely that they're not the demon. Kind of likely. Mm. Like, I could be drunk and could have been given all those. Um, they could they could be the all evil team, but I don't really think that's a world. So, yeah, yeah, and it's unlikely that Lydris 
as yeah. your if she was the they were the evil pig be yeah yeah so i don't i think so i like i really that math information i think is pretty helpful in knowing that we've got an evil we've got an evil between like just jc and debbie um mm-hmm. and i think i still think that tam fana i don't know i don't know i just i've seen hazel made that play as a good player before and so um so i don't know i still kind of think tam fan is evil <laughs> yeah I, I got that mm. vibe hazel could also be evil <laughs> When I'm the philo and you're not the philo, and yeah, and I, I definitely out of that confusion. I definitely did not back down from it. No, absolutely. Um, so you're just evil. Uh, I guess so. Um, um, but yeah. Um, so yeah, we'll see what happens okay. with that. Uh, I so might, yeah. Might, yeah, I might not go philo nature. I might go philo math. That could be even more fun. Um, yeah. So Kieran, Kieran claims dreamer to me and. Saw not the philosopher, and I told the storyteller in night one that I would be a uh, philosopher. Okay, so he might be might be the mutant. Which um, which day did he see you? Uh, night one, apparently. Okay, so because I poisoned him night two. Okay, <laughs> so might might be the mutant, might be the drunk. Okay, um, although drunk probably sees a philosopher. Yeah, um, I've been keeping Ollie alive because there's a clock maker too. Okay, um, so yeah, you might yeah. have to. I, I don't know whether Debbie's actually the politician, but you might have to fall back on that. Yeah, I uh, mean, right. I poisoned Debbie night one and Ollie last night, so... Okay, all right, I need to um, bug out of this yeah. conversation, but... Yeah, good luck. Cheers, bye. Okay, that's a possibility then. Otherwise, there's no damsel for you to guess. Unless it's Lydris, Godfather, plus one. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. You'll love to see it. Thank you very much. Hello. Hello, hello. To my third day of information. Third day of information. I'm prepared this time. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, I just, I just had to remember how I wanted to word these, because that's really important. Um, uh, okay. There are... No abilities in play that cause madness. Or, there are no abilities that would receive a number. And I can elaborate on any of those if you want, but... When you say in play, do you mean people uh, in, could in, be in, dead? In, uh, still... cu- currently in the town square, there are no abilities that Including cause madness. Cool. cool, so that's... so yeah. just. Like me, like, like me looking at the town square. There are no yeah. madness tokens. Amazing. And the um, other one, and the other one, receive a number. Um, I, so I, nothing like a chambermaid or things like that. Chambermaid, clockmaker. Uh, gotcha. What's the other one? The mathematician, possibly yep. MDX, so, so on and so forth. Depend, depend on how you want to interpret that. But yeah. No, oh, no worries. Thank you for that. Thanks. So that's gonna that could throw JC under the bus later. It's gonna make Tanfana look maybe a little better, and also when that clockmaker info comes out, it might not be trusted. So that was the reason for that. Obviously, both of those are incorrect because there is a madness in play, and there is an ability with numbers. Cool. Oh, okay. So. Hmm, so, okay, so then, that me. so if you, you could be next to Nodashi, or you could easily just be poisoned. Yeah, either or. Yeah, um, I don't, I don't know, yeah. I'm just like, I don't know, I, I'm slightly concerned about Ollie, because he's not said a thing in Town Square this entire game, and, like, uh, <laughs> I, I'm if he's the no dash, just poisoning me. Yeah, I'm of the mindset. I think killing Ollie or Debbie right now is a good idea. Two would be either Ollie or myself. If Tan um, and Debbie are both minions, potentially. Obviously, it also should be said that it could have been from me to Tan. Like that's also an option. 
Um, oh, if Debbie's actually the politician. What do you mean? You're the Fangu now. Which outsider were you? Yeah. Uh, I was the damsel. Right. Yeah. All right. Well. Um. Wait, who's the other minion? Lycris. <laughs> okay, cool. Awesome. There yeah. Go. They're good. Um, but I'm telling everyone mathematician. Ooh, he's, well, I guess that's okay. He's claiming philo math. Who is? Lydris. Lydris. Okay. Um, would that make me drunk or him? Yeah, that would make you drunk. Okay, that works. I've been giving everyone zeros. Cool. So, okay, cool. Thank you. Yep. Oh, no. Alrighty. Let's... Hello, town. Take a moment to Thank chat. You, Bottles will open. Um, it's very aggressive. So, Debbie has obviously publicly claimed outsider. Have we mm -hmm. heard of any others? I'm aware that none of them are particularly likely to be uh, forthcoming, but. There is a person who, if good, I believe may be an outsider. But that's just because their information doesn't seem to match up for me. Okay. Hey, nominations are open. Hmm. <clears throat> I, have, I have three people that I think... Um, would be good executions right now. Um, more on two of them specifically. Um, one that's in a double claim, and the and the other one is a possible Nodashi. Um, I guess I could nominate them. Uh, I will. I'll nominate Lydris. Okay. Is this the Nodashi or the double claim? This is the uh, double claim. Uh, so yeah, my accusation is uh, they told me a role that has been claimed to me. Okay, Lydris? Yeah, I'm aware that there was a double claim. Um, I'm also aware that the other person has been seen as something other than that double claim. Um, so I think this is a bad kill. Okay, if you want to put Lydris on the block, you need four votes. Can we get, like, a little bit more than that? <laughs> well, I just is also in a noble thing. I mean, I'll say that, okay, the, the Dreamer has seen them as something other than what they claimed, which is the double claim. Three is not enough. Lydris yeah. is safe. This is why I say I don't trust the Dreamer information. It's funny you'd say that, George. I, I, I've been open about this. Like, it's, there's no way to hide it. Like... Yeah, there's no, there's no sense. Like, we're not protecting, like me, by not specifying the nature of the claim. No, it's fair enough. Could somebody nominate Loki and pass me the accusation? Uh, Lydris will nominate Loki. Okay, and pass it over to JC. Pass it over to JC. Yeah. Okay. Um. So, I'm working off worlds at the moment where George is a fangu who jumped. Uh, hence me querying about outsiders previously. Um, I think it would be a fool's errand to jump to an outed politician in a noble ping, so I'm assuming that the jump would have happened elsewhere. Um, and in my world, myself, Lydris and Debbie are all good, so I think there's a chance that Loki is a drunk noble or a mutant who has come up with info just to get by. Um, and they may now be the Fangu. Okay. It's all hunch. There's nothing mechanical or particularly, to be honest, social, but it just lines up in my head. Okay, Loki. Uh, I am not an outsider. Uh, if you want to kill me, that's fine if it eliminates some worlds, but if it, um, if it leads you to, if, if we do this and it leads you to believe that I'm an outsider, I am not an outsider. Uh, I have been the noble. I've claimed that multiple times, and I haven't swayed from it. So, okay. Uh, nobody on the block. If you want to put Loki there, it'll take four. Loki, you do realize there's a drunk on this script, right? 
that is true. Yes, there is a junk. But um, I'm I'm not uh, evil as well, so that uh, debunks your theory. There we go. One is not enough. <laughs> Nobody on the block. Are there any Let's more nominations? Cat uh, nominates Debbie. Cat nominates Debbie. Why? Uh, just some hijinks with the politician. Are they mad from the Saranovas or not? It could be a Sarah Locke or maybe they are the politician, but also politicians not, I don't know, the best character to keep in. So, uh, yeah, just an option for Cam. Okay, Debbie. Uh, I am actually the politician, and I have a much higher chance of being able to sway the game one way or the other if I'm alive. And so far, I haven't decided which team I'm playing for, but I think I have the information for both. Both teams should keep me alive. Okay. Uh, If you want to put Debbie on the block, it'll take four. I think this is a bad kill. I think Debbie's good here. I'd still, kill, I'd still rather kill into a potential noble ping in a possible fang outside of Fangu world. Four I'd, ra- I'd, I'd rather have re-killed Lydra's there. But Debbie on the block, kill... final call. Um, Andrew, can I just specify something with you? Yeah. Yep. Would you count a player being chosen but if a savant had information to say that a player was targeted by three abilities would you include the noble ping as being targeted um i guess it would depend on the very on the specific uh wording of it um that's something that a potential savant can go over with me but um because okay. it, it, there's really the distinction between targeted or chosen or um something like that but uh, that's that's kind of a weird question to answer uh, for sure. That's something that I would want to talk to Savant about. Okay, that's fair. Yep. I, I do get the execution of Debbie here, but I really think she's good in, in yeah, just how she's behaved. Uh, Debbie will nominate Nick. Okay. Prosecution? Uh, Nick is a start knowing role and therefore you use their ability. I appreciate what you're saying that I could be a Fangu. I'm not. Um, I very specifically said to every demon candidate not to jump to me if they were the Fangu. I would like to stay alive to gather more information and decide what team I want to be on. Okay, Nick. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'm the clockmaker. I got a two. Uh, if you want to execute me instead of Debbie, go okay. ahead. Okay, there's four on Debbie, five will put Nick on the block. I mean, we have a one, two, three, four, five. Two is not enough. Seven, eleven. Final call. End of the day in ten. <laughs> Debbie is executed and dies. And the game continues. Hmm. How did I word that first day savant info? Because I, I noted, <clears throat> I, I've been writing them down, <clears throat> that uh, I noted chosen by three abilities, but I specifically remember that I was going to try to word it not like that exactly. Uh, I will have to chat with them. Oh, because we can do that now. Hello. Okay, hello. Can, uh, this is just an aside. Can you uh, confirm how I worded your day one info? Not one player was affected by three abilities. Okay, that's what I thought I did. Just wanted to make that sure. That must be did. I'm not sure who's passed all my information incorrectly, but... It's all uh, good. As long as as long as I told you the correct wording, then we are fine. No, no, you so. did. I was right. surprised me when Debbie came out with it. I'm like, okay, my information's been getting out there. But no, no worries. Appreciate it. Okay, I thought so. Because I, I specifically didn't want to say targeted because then it wouldn't count the noble. Okay. Uh, dead. Dead. Uh, no longer poisoned. I mean, technically no longer mad, but I'm just going to leave that there. Uh, do, 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 do. We will start with 
Lydris. Hello. Hello. Please select a player. Yeah, this is going to be an interesting choice because if I think the damsel's still alive, I probably don't want to hit them in case I need to pick them. Uh, I'm going to stick with Ollie. Ollie it is. Thank you. Thank you. Yep, really good pick. Um... Go all the way to cat now. Hello. Hi. Please select a player. Uh, I'll pick Kieran. Kieran it is. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Bumpy start for evil, but uh, they're coming out really strong here, especially because now their one piece of ongoing info is poisoned. Um, that's it. That's that's the night. So I guess we'll hang out for a minute. Uh, let's decide our poisoned savant info. Um, let's see. We could try to sell a non-Fangu game. We've already eliminated. But we potentially eliminated like four town rolls and a Saranovis from the Savant's uh, information. Hmm. We could uh, be a little cheeky and say that there is no drunk or poisoning in play. That's cheeky. Or... Um... What's, a, what's another good one? Kind of leaning like there are no living outsiders. There's a, there's one dead evil player. Hmm. We're going to have Loki, Lydris, Cat, Ollie, and Nick in the end. There is either one evil or one outsider still alive. Let's try that. Either one evil out alive. Okay, that works. And we've killed more than enough time uh, due to the small night. So let's bring everybody back. Uh, oh, that was everybody. Well, good job, bot. Uh, good morning, town. Kieran has died in the night. Hmm. Okay. Very interesting. You have five um, living players. Andrew, can we chat? Yep. Uh, Kieran, can we talk? Alrighty. Let's see. I think what I decided on... I don't like spending two minutes of your time trying to think of stuff. Uh, uh -huh. Either there are no characters in play that cause drunkenness or poisoning, or there is either one evil player alive or one outsider alive.
Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Make a two as you to Ollie. Um, yep. So yeah, I don't. I don't. I've got a three from from him with Kane made as as one of them, which I know is a bluff. So I'm I'm guessing Savant based on how things are going. I'm guessing Amni because JC claimed to be the Savant day one. I think. Fair enough. He gave me Amni Savant in a two, so I was like, well, could be the one. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, yeah, I, I I'm not sure how good a position we're in. Like, I'm ho hoping maybe Lydris gets some some confirmation based on the double claim, but if they if they think that like uh I picked the wrong bluff or whatever, then that's presumably going to implicate him at some point. Right. As not a demon with their own bluff. Um <sighs> but the noble ping might help us out. Yeah. Um it throws up anything wacky for that, but I just got oh, Fangu and uh politician. Which, to be uh, fair, yeah, I think you're always going to get that, aren't you? Yeah, it's more, think... to say, it's more to say if you're a minion pissing about, actually, than. But that's you're... you know what? That's a very good point. Yeah, <laughs> I think that's that fair. that reads night two poison to me. Yeah, um, because yeah, yeah I I 100 believe George is the Fangu um, with a clockmaker two between him and Tamfana, and just the way George has played this game, um, that just yeah. If he's not the fine goo, I will be amazed. Um, and you read Debbie correctly, so I don't think you're the drunk. Um, yeah. I so you know I mean, what? Loki. The yeah, Loki's sticking on Noble. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm really emotional now because I, I really wanted to make it to final three and then just have a wacky <laughs> decide who I'm playing for then. And really, by I feel like my hand has been forced because I don't see evil getting out of this probably. No. Um, so I think we just execute the demon. Yeah, which is what, it's, like your cat? Uh, it's cat. Cat was the starting damsel. Oh, was she? I think so, yeah. Um, yeah, I've been told there's a damsel in play, and oh, no, okay. Kieran isn't the drunk. If Ollie can clarify whether or not being part of the Noble Pings would account for his day one savant information, I think I was poisoned and oh. made mad day one. Yeah, I can believe that. And um, part of the noble ping. I don't see another... Unless... No, there's no you... other ability to pick me day one, I don't think. On the town square that caused madness. Oh, in play in the town square. I thought it meant in play as an active, because the abilities... No, in... the, the pixie ability is no longer in play, because the pixie's dead. But I was basically looking at the town square. There are no abilities okay. in play that cause madness. Okay. I would have interpreted it the other way. Um, so I actually think that you didn't get too false information and were poisoned. I think that there's no current ability of madness in play since both Pixie and Sarah Novus are dead. But um, that's just how I perceive that. Fair. In that case, then, it would mean no abilities would receive a number, but there is a clockmaker two out there, which I do kind of get a good read on. Okay. There's Grand a mathematician the on the script, right? Uh, potentially yes, but I've not heard of a hard. And there's a chambermaid on the script, so there are ongoing number receiving abilities in play. But a clockmaker is done and over with by day three as well. So I guess, I guess I'm kind of caught in the fact that this is day three information and not starting gate information. Yeah, yeah. I get that. All right, um, but yeah, I'm i probably gonna hold my ghost vote anyway. But I don't see why we shouldn't go after Lydris as the final noble ping. Yeah. It's kind of where I'm leaning, and then it's one of either Loki or Cat, possibly. Do you think, you think Debbie actually is the politician, you said? I'm leaning more that way, given how frustrated they were with that. I I can kind of buy a little... Um, minion. Right, cause, so I minion? think we're on the same page here, because I think me and Loki were also thinking the same thing, <laughs> of it I'd being Ollie Ollie. and Lydra's minion. Yeah. But then what, what demon would Ollie be? Mm. I don't know. Because if it's a Nodashi, it doesn't work. Make sure it's on this. And if it's a Vigor Mortis... Also... I don't know. Yeah. I feel like... I don't oh, know. Or could it have been 
George, who is two away from Fantana? Because people are talking about Fangujin. Right. Why do we think it's Fangujin? I haven't heard of any other outsider. That's true. Do we still think that I'm the, out, the, I'm the outsider? No. It could, it, it's possible that I'm the drunk as well. <laughs> Sounds that like is we true. Have two conflicting but then, no, but that or, would be or, implying or that could George. Be drunk. Or if it's a mutant and people just can't say they're right now. No, but then if if we're thinking that George was the Fangu, the demon would have to jump. Uh, okay. Alrighty, town. Thanks for coming. Uh, take a moment to chat, and then I'm open. Um, is it worth us considering a round robin at this point? Sure. Do you want me to do the board? Oh, go on, I'd love that, Debbie. Yeah, the, De the Debbie round robin would, do it, do would it. be pretty sore. <laughs> Debbie, tell us who everyone is, go for it. Uh, what number do you want to start at? Uh, Name a clock well. face. I mean, it's, a, it's an 11 sided clock. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're absolutely right, I forgot we're missing one. <laughs> do you want to start at me for dramatic reveal purposes? Oh, sure. Uh, we've got JC as the pixie. Kieran as the dreamer. Ooh. Ollie as the pixie confirmed Savon. Uh, Nick is the clockmaker with a two. Tanfana is the Serenovus. Me is the politician who's sad about being dead. Mm. Uh, George is the starting Fangu. Hazel is either the poppy girl or the snake charmer. Uh, Loki is the noble. Mm -hmm. Lydris is the poisoner. And Kat is the new Fangu starting damsel. Well, well, I have some notes. Mm. <laughs> Got some corrections. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, I could definitely see Lurdris as the poisoner, uh, given the double claim of my role and a noble ping. Um, I can definitely see George as the Fangu, given the double claim of my role. <laughs> and the clockmaker too. My, yeah, my and suggestion would too. be it's more likely it's if there is a Fangu that it's either gone to Nick or it is maybe is Nick probably not with the clockmaker but probably not <laughs> nominations are open uh, I just want to correct I'm actually the mathematician and I've been getting zeros every night and I, I want to correct I'm actually the feeler who turned into the mathematician on night three you uh, zeros I got, no, I got a one and then a zero. Uh, Karen, are you willing to out your information now that you're dead? Oh, I've already told that to people. It's, okay, uh, but could you tell it to the class? Would that uh, be all right? Oh, I, I, I still think there's a wonderful world where you could just be the Fangu. Um, I mean, okay, but like, I, I appreciate that's happened, but like, we've, 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 we've had conversations in this game about not freezing people out, right? And. Uh, yeah. Okay, thank you. Uh, uh, so night one, uh, George Fangu, Snake Charmer. Night two, Loki, Boz Magoon. Night three, Debbie Fangu, Politician. Loki, can you mute, please? For a sec. While that's going on. Thank you. Yeah. So, yeah, I think... I mean, there's a decent chance I was just poisoned night two. Because in the world where you're the Fangu, that all just makes... That's all makes decent sense. George. What was your third? You had three nights information? Uh, third night is uh, Debbie Fangu, politician, because I wanted to check if they were a minion, just being evil, and making us waste all our time. <laughs> I, I, um, Vidris, yeah. why did you choose mathematician? I was originally thinking poppy grower, um, and then <laughs> thought maybe no, um, so yeah, decided mathematician because there seemed to be a lot of drunkenness around. So, I thought it was worth checking. Yeah. For contrast, I picked Poppy Grow immediately because, of course, I would. Yeah, like, I think. I think the problem I is in the world. In the world where I've got sober information for nights one and three, George or the Fangu, it means I've seen Debbie as the politician or the fa Fangu. That combined with the noble ping, where JC died first, means they're probably not the minion. In that. Which only leaves Lydris as the possible minion. That that the that that... But the person who's claiming noble and providing noble information you saw as the goon or the poisoner, you said. Yes, but I could also just have been poisoned that night. Second call for nominations. 
I would like we to like to just go for Lydris? Just I think we go for Cat or... because they're the demon candidate. I doubt that yeah. Lydris is the demon, is the thing. Yeah, we right. need to go after demon candidates only. And okay. Lydris I... is either telling the truth or a minion almost certainly the poison. I agree. Sorry, that was who? Ollie. Thank you. Uh, why? Um, I mean, Debbie kind of succinctly put it um, with the uh, round robin there, um, which I honestly I do believe at this point. Um, I'm just move on. I will dump my information in the chat. I do believe that there's still a poisoner out there because I kind of think that I'm in the target of said poisoning for one of the last two nights at the very least. Um, and I trust the other two more than I trust Cap. And I believe there has been a jump, so Cap. Okay, Cap. Um, if that's what Town thinks, that's okay. Um, I think I'm an okay Town's folk to die. I mean, information-wise. Um, however, I am going to be nominating Ollie just because I have heard other information that makes them a little more suspicious from other players. Okay. You... Sorry, Ollie, could, could you mute, please? There's a lot of feedback off your uh, mic. Uh, Loki, yeah. Oh, sorry, I, I meant Loki, sorry. Yeah. Uh, all right, if you want to put Cat on the block, you need three votes. We get more hands on this. Yeah, why did you drop there, Nick? Yeah. What? Three is enough. Cat is on the block. Cool. Uh, Cat nominates Ollie. Okay. Uh, for what reason? Uh, I was going to do this anyway. Um, but I heard Clockmaker 2 from Tantana, who people believe is a minion. Um, and I really don't know anything about Ollie's role. Um, so yeah, I, for me, Ollie is my demon candidate. Uh, I currently pretty much trust Loki and Nick, and I hope that's good. Can I, uh, can um, I add? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, please. Nick and Loki. To that? Yeah. Please add. <laughs> yeah. Um, in the in the round robin, um, we had said that JC's uh, pixie and is confirming Ollie. Uh, JC, can you verify that? Yeah, I can. Okay, um, just off my clockmaker info. I, I don't know. Obviously, I don't know if it's fully reliable, but if I'm gonna trust it, I got a two. So there is a possibility that it is JC and Ollie just working together, and I don't know. If it's Cat, who would be a minion in that example? If it's either Loki or Kirin. But then again, I, I could have just been poisoned or something. Uh, a drunk JC right. with uh, Ollie the Demon is also possible right, in that scenario. Right. Let, let's give Ollie his, uh, his moment now to say his part. Um, yeah, I know, I've know i known this Clockmaker too since I think day two at this point when I spoke to Nick. And mm -hmm. anyone I've spoken to, I've said, if you want to kill me to eliminate worldviews, I'm more than happy to die, because obviously if it's not George, it does point to me. Um, I am Pixie confirmed by JC. If you think I'm the demon, then obviously JC could be my minion. But at this point, with only three on cat, I wouldn't be shocked if there's enough evils currently on the board to overput it and put it onto me currently. All right, there are three on cat. If you want to put Ollie on the block, you need four. Uh, with a drunk JC with Ollie as, min, uh, as demon, that would mean that he would have to be not Fengu, because JC died in the night, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. So then you would think that Debbie was evil. One is not enough. Uh, Kat is still on the block. Loki, Lydris, and Nick, would any of you like to nominate? No. 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 All right, with that, Cat is executed and dies, and everybody go to sleep later on, or whenever you choose mm -hmm. to, because the game is over. Mm -hmm. Alright. Yeah. Good team has won. Yeah. That was uh, a very profitable dead person chat we had. I have, uh, I have one quick question for you, Andrew. Yep. How late was I in telling you that I was going to be claiming Philosopher? Um, it may or may not have been an oversight, but you know, it kind of worked okay. out a little bit in some ways, but um, uh. yeah, when I'm getting direct DMs trying to set up, I I, yeah, I, 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 I appreciate. Be, I, I try to be like, yeah, cool, and then. Hopefully yeah, I should. I should have said it the instant that the bluffs came through. But, gosh, it hurt later on yeah. that I had been dreamed as not that. Yeah, well, there was Sorry, a poisoner out there, and Kieran was poisoned at one point, just not 
that yeah. night. Uh, JC was your starting pixie who saw Ollie as a savant. Ollie, you received poison info on day three and day four. Everything you were told was a lie. Um, the other one, uh, day one, your correct info was a player was affected by three abilities. That was Debbie the politician who was poisoned, made mad, and a noble ping. Uh, they were made mad as the politician, but Debbie was already the politician, so that just created some humorous moments. Huh. Uh, your day two true info was that the outsider count was changed. That is because we had a starting Fangu. Uh, Kieran, you were the dreamer. You got true info every night, and except for the one that you picked Loki, you were poisoned that night. Uh, Nick was a clockmaker who received a two. That was true. Tanfana was your Sarah Novus. George was your starting Fangu who jumped to Cat, your starting damsel. Hazel was your poppy grower, Loki was the noble, and Lydris was the poisoner, bluffs for chambermaid, philo, and mathematician. So, well. let me grab the voting link. So anybody who's in the chat, please use this link to vote on which script you like more so they can advance to the next round. Cool. Um, yeah, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks to all my players for coming and doing this. Uh, I'm going to go say goodbye to chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. Yeah, again, thanks everybody for coming. Thanks for the follows. There is a bit of follows that I wasn't able to get to everybody. Wow, that's that's. thank you. Greatly appreciated for you guys coming by and just hanging out. Uh, yes, please vote for one of these scripts uh, so we can have a really uh, exciting next round of the World Cup. And, yeah, um, let me do a little bit of community service here. And who is our next World Cup stream? I believe we have we have one more uh, bit of World Cup for this round, game 48. That is Lunatics Asylum versus Misinformation on the official Clock Tower server. Um... I don't have the date. I believe it's going to be this cup upcoming Thursday. Um, yes, this Thursday, the 25th, is the final round of this little bit of Blood on the Clock Tower World Cup on the official server Thursday. Uh, cool. See you guys then, and we'll see you guys in the next round, and thanks for coming. Bye-bye.